Welcome back to a new stream slash YouTube beauty uh, on my Twitch and YouTube channel. Today we are, as always at the moment, continuing with Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, I will be streaming a bit of other stuff in the upcoming time again, okay? We'll be playing some DVD this upcoming week with Alan Wake coming out and, you know, maybe looking into some other things as well. I think Poppy's Playtime 3 is actually releasing now finally too, which is something I may want to do on stream as well. But for today, we continue with Red Dead Redemption 2. And yeah, I've now reached a point already where there's always a couple of breaks between my sessions. Like in the first week, we basically played every day for hours non-stop. Now the second week, I think it's now been two weeks actually, um, it's always been a few days between, which also means that I haven't played the game since our last stream. Yeah, that means I didn't do a off-stream session this time around um, since the last time we played the game, which means that there's also nothing to like catch up on or to be like, you know, update like, hey, I did that and that and I went there and there. Nope, that didn't happen this time, um, which means we can just continue right away. And say hello, good to see you. Um, when was the last year? I think on the 25th. What was the 25th again for a day? And that was first day, yeah, exactly. It was first day morning or something, from Wednesday to first day. Then Friday I had work, Saturday there was the Royal Rumble, and now it's basically Sunday to Monday, so yeah. That's that's what we didn't play in between. Mm, I do definitely want to start to, at least if I don't stream it, at least to do like one or two hours daily. Because again, I've talked about it, the moment you, you don't play for a few days, especially the story, it kind of gets loosened up a little, right? You, you kind of want to keep playing to really... To really, you know, stay in the in the groove, both gameplay-wise, so like we just to know, you know, the map and the story and everything. And yes, same thing. I did so as well. I even made some live reactions uh, once more. Um, so you can gladly check that out on my YouTube channel. Um, as she said, the last thing we did um, to end the recent stream was that party after we saved Sean. Um, and that's exactly where we continue off. Like, where we continue now, yeah? Nothing else happening between. Really continue right where we left off of. Um, and yeah, I watched Royal Rumble as well. I did some live reactions to it. And I must say, actually, the Women's Royal Rumble was really good. A uh, great finale, right, winner, Jade was impressive. The men's Royal Rumble, actually, kind of disappointing in terms of how the general match was. Like, like Andrade being back is cool, um, the pad spot was funny, the R-Truth spot was funny and everything. And the final showdown with Punk and Cody was also pretty damn great. Um, and the fact that Cody won again was a huge shocker, by the way. I really didn't expect it, I thought 100% it would be Punk. Um... And I have no problem with that either, even though obviously, you know, but, um, was just shocking to see. But, like, besides that, you know, uh, I don't know, previous years were better, definitely. Kind of, uh, just didn't really flash me that much, unfortunately. Um, trim your own hair. Applies any promo to your own hair. My my beard looks good, but I hate how my hair looks like. Funnily enough, exactly how it's right now in real life too. I definitely need to go to the barber soon. Uh, trim my own hair. How do we do this? All facial hair, chops. All right, now we are on length 5 of 10. What's your current length? Oh. I've... That applied now? Wait, but how can I... Oh, wait. The only thing I can... Oh, this is shaving. I can only shave my beard, but I can't do my hair. I need to do that with... Um, I need to do that with my other... Or like, at the barber. Okay, good to know. Um, yeah, again, the beard looks fine to me. Keep the beard the way it is. Um, so, yeah, what we are going to be doing is... This main quest, I guess. Jose got something for me? Charles wants to go hunting. And here's the new quest with John. Charles takes Arthur hunting for bison. But what does Jose want? That's what I'm interested in the most right now. Okay. Oh dear. This is gonna be a long day. <laughs> Uh, we can do some course, but morning, nah. Arthur. Hey, Tilly. Hey. Morning, Tilly. Good morning. Um, 
Oh, once again, this game is so gorgeous. We saw black water. There's pink and tins everywhere. Well, you can give me a request. That's no what we're doing. Man? I don't think so. Not for now, anyway. You like this offer, don't you? I found this. Oh, one of the books I found. I remember. Thank you, Arthur. I do request. Lock updated. What does it do? Is it just... Also enjoys crown. No, let's find one for him. Return to your tent later for reward. Oh. Okay. Um. I first want to ask what John got for me, and then maybe we do the hunting thing with with uh, with Charles. Okay, John, what do you got? Hey, Arthur. What's up, bro? What are you want? Uncle told me something about a train. <sighs> what did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows just south of state border. Yes. Need help with it? I ain't even sure about doing it. Oh Come yeah, on. I remember we Night, we had that on too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, we had this as an idea already. It. And John stopping a train wants to do pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is a good idea. Kind of brilliant uh, for you. <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. <laughs> So sure, I already forgot that John was the one we we got from the the mountain. Real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Okay, so this is now basically anyway. the next ask. big step in the story is robbing this train. Yeah, I know just the place. Hence, They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack yeah. just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. Um, I know what oil thing you were talking about, definitely. Uh, wagons that can be stolen for John are blipped with the yellow thingy. Um... Oh, and now suddenly Micah wants to do something with us. Okay. And I remember the last time we met him, we were breaking him out of strawberry. Wait, I kind of wanted to go to anyways because we can do a robbery there. But I think the first thing I want to do is go here because I'm pretty sure that the hunting will be here where the bisons are and then we can steal those basically right after. Uh, so let's do that first. Um, how's it by the way looking like in the... Hey Lenny! Ooh, I'm gonna need a lot of coffee. Contribute. I got a lot of money, otherwise they only have $77. Nothing is in here. Let me donate a little bit, huh? Here, people. Take 30. We're at least over 100. Miss O'Shea. Arthur. Um, they need food, too, but do I even have food still? I'm not sure. Good morning, Arthur. Do I still have something? Yeah, enough. We could really use some more meat, Mr. Morgan. Here, take it all. Just take time, it all. Many Open thanks, your eyes, Sean. Okay, hunting with Charles. What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. Have we done something with Charles yet, actually? I think he was with us Bison. when we robbed the train, Bison? but I think this is the Bison. first solo mission with him. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Uh, Hunting generally is something I still need to do so much. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Really got the, to do some hunting off stream. Because that will definitely take a while, finding all of them and getting them all back. That's definitely nothing I want to do on stream. That will take so much time. The legendary hor the legendary things I definitely want to do on stream. Even though I did do one of them already off stream with the wolf, my but... My mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. The bison went, my people went. And they were the 
center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood, but I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. Let's try over here, to the left. Mm, that's where I would have thought. This is where I did one of the shootouts with the Mexican guy. It's now already like 30 hours ago. Oh, over yeah. There. You see them all? Incredible, aren't they? Oh. Whoops. Come on. I thought we'd stop a bit earlier. Um. The question is, I, I, do I even have the right weapons for hunting yet? I know that uh, that this is great for small animals like foxes and rabbits, but besides that, maybe the bow. We should only kill one of them. Okay. I'll keep them ringed in, and you see if you can bring one down. Okay. Clean as you can. Okay. Oh wait, he wants me to send horse probably. Okay, I'm supposed to kill one of them. But which one is the question? Oh my, I'm a bit in the middle. Oh, I'm a bit in the middle here. Whoa! Sorry, buddy. Oh, whoopsie. Sorry, John. Need to hit you with that one. Damn, this thing is tanky! Okay, gotcha. Damn it, that's be kind of brutal though, you know what I mean? Oh shit, he's not even dead yet. Wait, he isn't dead yet, he's just on the ground. No, he should be though. Oh my god, look at how big and realistic it looks like though. That's insane. Aww. Damn, bisons are... Man. Bisons are such insane animals though, like for real. The size of them, even in game, you feel you know the size of how huge they are. And now imagine actually standing in front of that in real life, Christ! So massive. Um, but yeah, that kind of brutal. Not even gonna lie, all the other ones are just you know looking, looking at it, and can't really do much about it. And the worst part is we leave so much behind too. Good Look job. at all of that. Stow that on your horse and mount up. I wanna. Go check something out. Look at how much we leave behind. I mean, there will be other animals in the in the, in the food chain that will okay. make Let's something go. out of it, but so. Okay, my girl. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what attracted them. Hmm. I got a pretty horse, actually. I think I'm nearly max level with my with my new horse too. And then I'm already thinking, hmm, the moment I have a horse on four, do I maybe want to try to get another one, or to just have as many horses on maximum, you know, as possible? But I really like my blizzards. Oh. No. Look, bison. Ah. Uh, left for dead. It looks like. That's trophy hunters. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. Yeah. I said we follow him. Didn't All even right. take the horns. The yeah, now that's the thing. We we killed one bison of a herd, mostly for the meat, plus you know the horns. Yeah, like actually you know make something out of what we found. These bisons were basically just shot for fun. Could it have been an animal? No, they've been shot. And you know that's I don't it. Don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. Exactly. I mean, we left a lot of carcass back there too, but like mentioned, we basically put, took everything possible. They like mentioned just killed them and then boom. And that's not how you do it. Look, another dead bison on the hill to the right. Come on. Oh yeah, it, it spawned right in front of me. I think Shot this is for dead again. Yeah. But this one looks fresher. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. Who was that, huh? Hmm. Oh, 
Wolves haven't gone cold yet. Maybe half a day since they left? Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. Can I even get up there, actually? It also looks pretty high. Funnily enough, I remember seeing a video, only the thumbnail though, about, you know, jumping from the highest place at every Rockstar game. Have a good view from up I wonder if that might be that in, in Red Dead. Because this game definitely doesn't look like it has that okay. many huge mountains. Actually, that one's pretty big too. See anything? Yeah, there's a camp over there. See some smoke yeah. Maybe another camp. I love how you can actually do that. You see smoke in the right. sky and you know hey, there's Let's a camp. Go. There's something worth to check out. The question is, I wonder if I've been there before. Because that's very possible that I've been on that place already. Doing other stuff before I had this quest. Just killing for fun. We can ah. I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Yep, that's exactly the difference. Killing one bison for hunting for survival needs in terms of hello. What the hell? Yeah. Or for meat and you know the pelt and whatnot, that's one thing. Shooting just several of them without making any usage of it's just, you know, for fun, that's just that's just cruel. <laughs> Look, more dead bison. Jesus. Come on, wait up. Okay, so Charles is definitely more of a honorful hunter. Gotta feel unsafe without my shotgun with me, actually. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison, we'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. Oh, it's that business of mine! Jesus! Oh, but. Good job. I got a family. A family. On um, this bison stones? Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. What the hell are you doing? Yeah, that's what I'm asking you. Why are you killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as mm. we could. But by who? It looked like it was Indians. Oh. No. Oh, please, don't kill me. I'm begging you. All right. Now get out of here. Just don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. If he hadn't said that before, oh, I wouldn't have done it. do that? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. Maybe I should have killed I'm him. I'm gonna see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. Maybe I could have... Or well, maybe I should have shot him. Because now this is once again that big question that I've always had earlier already. Because I've yet to really feel it in this game. If leaving certain people alive or killing them really makes a difference. Like, if I now don't kill him here, is it possible that later down I can see him kill another bison for money and then I have to kill him? But in the meantime, I'll, like, in return more bison died because I didn't kill him right away. Entirely possible. But the fact that I did get, um, s um honor for it, it definitely looks like this was the correct moral decision. For now. Who knows if I have to kill him later. Um, this is still being shown as investigative area though, so I feel like there's more here. I feel like I can maybe find a note that can give me the information I need to find them. But where? I actually don't think I see anything else here. This looks like something I should be able to open, but I somehow can't. Oh, I can. Aha! Oh, that's just, uh, well. Okay. It's just a craft document. I do. Have I even. I think I've not crafted any weapons yet. I think I've always just bought something. It's just easier because crafting takes so much time. Um, poison throwing knife. Ah. Throwing knives are very difficult to hit, and. I don't know, poison arrows are probably better. Okay, but that's it then. 
Um, yeah, maybe I should have killed the other guy. He would have had a document to, you know. Because again, if why didn't what why did we let him leave if he didn't even tell us who paid them? That's what we should have asked. We kind of needed to know who, you know, so that I can go after them now. But well, and yeah, I had been here before. That's about it. Um. Oh. Okay. That's it with this quest star. I think there's nothing else to it. He just left now. He's he's leaving. Uh, that means now, as I thought, we can grab one of those corn oil wagons. Yep. While we're in the area. And then after that, maybe look what Mika got and rob a store in, in Strawberry. Sounds like an idea. Buddy. Hello. How's it even looking like with my honor now? Yeah, we're once again around the middle. I feel like there was never a point where it was like really deep down or high up. Always more down than... Oh! Clear the wagon, sir. Ah, sons of bitches. Be quiet. Who's you back there, there anyway? The hell do you think you're doing? I'll kill all of you. Will you just shut up back there? Ah, uh, that's four of them. I, I'll leave it. I'm sorry, dude. Okay, girl. Um, I think I know what this would have been. I think I will lose some honor now, though, by leaving it alone and ignoring this, right? I think that's what happens when strangers appear in you, you know? I think we even had that on stream already. Actually, no, not this time. He's now out of the, the map, but okay. What would have happened here is I would have needed to kill the lawmen or incapacitate them, whatever. And then I rescued that, that prison guy. And he would give me a tip for a robbery, actually. Like the one in Strawberry. That's like how I got the Strawberry robbery tip. But I don't know. That looked like a couple of people and... Uh, didn't feel like this time. Um, I don't think I've been here before, actually. Or, like, in it. And I wonder if there's something in it, actually. Like, besides now this wagon that could be of importance. Let me check quickly. As I once again open the beautiful map. Currently Treasure Hunter. And something for online, but that's basically it. And there's a register rock. Find a cheat code here, some fast travel options. Ah, oh, this rock is this one, I have to, I've done that already. So besides that, there's actually, there's literally nothing here really of importance in this area, which is kind of crazy. Like maybe some minor items, but like nothing big or memorable or necessary. And again, can I just browse through here or will I be attacked? Never been in here before, so I can't tell. And this looks pretty, like, yeah. You see what I mean? There's some guards. Oh, well, it's in there, huh? It's pretty much in there. Well, how do I get in there then? Would it got without causing too much of a riot? Maybe I have to cause a riot. Take my horse here. That was so bad. I still have to buy some pelt actually, so I shouldn't lose it. Even though, what even is it for one? Is it a perfect one or just a regular? I can tell. Oh, they even got one up here, by the way. Two actually. Okay, how how am? Okay, I think I need to do some crazy shooting. I think. Oh, wait, actually, isn't it there? Oh, wait, I think it's actually on the outside. Don't even need to get in there. Wait, then definitely come back here, bro. But I'm surprised it took this long to actually do something with this because it's so good nearby to our camp. But yeah, there it is. Oh, wait, no. Oh, the, the other one I saw above is the one in, in Strawberry and uh, Valentine. The other one is still in there. So I say, I do definitely need to do something in here and steal it. But is it like... Is there a horse on it or do I need my own horse? 
Right, so I think I need to... Well, I think we'll have to do some shooting in here. And that will definitely cost us some... Some honor. But I fear there's no other way. Well, then let's try to do the sneaky. Surprised nobody was at this exit, actually. There it is. Okay, I can definitely just steal it that way. The thing is, if I just jump on it and just start to run away, they will shoot it and I will just explode, right? There's another one. Jesus, there's so many here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, you, 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 you mind your business. Good. You know, lawman, you're just an underpaid worker. I think I need to go the secret way, though. I think first shooting everything and then kind of won't work. I fear. That's two of them, though. Which one is it? Does it matter? I wish I had a noisemaker like an A in isolation. That would be great right now, where I could just throw throw it away. Um. Also, I didn't take my weapons with me! Oh, I hate this so much. I hate this system. I mean, I only want to jump on the horse anyways, but... Okay, but what I can do... Is cause a distraction with dynamite, maybe? I'm not sure if that works, though. Ah, uh, you know what? Three, two, one, go. Just three, two, one, and go. Vehicle theft. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. At least I'm not hitting the oil. And we out of here. Yeah, I think that was the only thing I can I can do here. And this is definitely also the most honorful way to do it because again, if I just shoot everybody first and then steal it, I I lose like 50 honor, obviously. So. This is definitely the right way to do it. Okay. Well, that was easy though. Weak theft without any capacities. That's what we want to see. The question is, is one enough or do we need more? I'm not sure and I'm not sure if I now got some a bounty either. We have enough money to just pay it off directly if necessary, but that's why I don't see anything. Because again, we didn't wear our bandana. Yeah. We were basically invisible. I hope these fellas up here will leave me alone. Hey there. Hey, partner. Um. I was about to say we're losing oil the entire time. Are we? Oh, I think it's just trail. Imagine we're just leaving like a trail of oil behind and then when we arrive there's just nothing left anymore. What what time of the year is it by the way? Because it looks pretty hot at the distance. Can't check right now sadly. Like when you look at the back you see like the, the heat going up. Kind of lot. Oh, they've been here before, I think. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Ooh. I have been here before, I think. <laughs> Does that even work, actually, in real life? That the horses can go back like that? I feel like it shouldn't work, but. Oh, it does. No, oh, Jesus. Tight corner. Ugh. Damn. Alright, and we bring it here. But yeah, we didn't get a bounty reported because we had a bandana. Nice. Lovely. 
Oh, but it is losing oil. I saw that. It did drop some. Right? Hey, poor horses. Could have used those. Pouring foil of oil too. Isn't it dripping? Shit, it's dripping! It's literally dripping. Deliver the wing. Uh, that's whatever. But like, isn't it literally dropping oil? Are we literally just losing everything right now? Oh, man. I mean, okay. Wait, where's my horse now, actually? Damn. Oh my god. This is why I hate missions like this. My horse is now so far away. Oh, and my weapons are on it too. Oh, I hate that. That's so dumb. Again, that's such a... Again, the system that your weapons will always be with your horse, which again, is realistic, blah, blah, blah. But like, it's gameplay-wise annoying. I just... I just don't know what to say at this point. The last time we streamed Red Dead Redemption 2... Actually, I think it was before that. Uh, I already had, like, insane connection problems and the game, you know, like, the stream disconnected twice. Slash my internet in general. This time it wasn't my internet, though. This time it was my PC. Which, again, has happened so many times before, which is everything freezes entirely and I can't even use the task manager. And I just don't get it, because any time that happens, the first thing I do, after then I finish the rest of the stream, or even directly maybe afterwards, the first thing I do is go and check, um, you know. I mean, actually there is kind of a good side to it, because now my horse is nearby, so I don't have to run that much. Um, actually all part of the plan. No, but seriously, I just don't get it, because any time that happens, Anytime my entire PC freezes like that, and I can't even open the task manager, which is, if you think about it, actually insane. Like, holy moly, that's it's crazy. If you can't even open the freaking task manager. Um, I do that. Like, I can't do that. And then, like, the only option I have is to hard shut it down. Yeah? Press the button on that PC, hold it for, like, 3 or 5 seconds so that it can actually shut down. And that's, that's not good. That hurts the PC a lot. But, like, it's literally the only option I have. I mean, I do must say, actually, I've never tried to actually just, you know, leave the PC on its own for, like, 10 minutes to see if maybe, maybe there's, an, there's a chance that it just, you know, comes back into it somehow. But, like, even that, though, right? Even the fact that it freezes for so long that I would have to wait for, like, minutes, which might not even be guaranteed, for it to work again is already crazy. And I just don't, I just don't get it. Because if I then check my PC for problems... Yeah, I run the repair thingy from Windows. There's never a problem. I still got bruises, you know. Lucky I went easy on you. So, well, then there's never a problem. It just makes no sense, you know what I mean? Somehow, anytime I check for problems, there's no problem, and then there's problems. It's like, as if, you know... I'm just always getting shit on by everything and everyone. Hello again. Go on, have yourself a quick nosy. It's worth buying. I'll buy. It. So yeah, it's just mm. it's so annoying, man. Now where did you get this, I wonder? Yeah, you shouldn't wonder. Mm. Let's give me the money. We made around hundred here. Because you can't see the money, sadly. Thanks for your help. Thank you. Really. That's cool, girl. Why are you putting that mask on? You knew you you knew how I am anyway, so why are you even bother asking? Um, yeah, to get back into it again, it's like it's just freaking frustrating. It's so annoying. Um, I guess we first go back for John, and maybe do the the train thing already, and then we go for Mika to Strawberry. Right? Sounds like an idea. I say. Wait, even though I wanted to check something here. Hey, hey there, partner. I was told something about a girl in the window at this house right here. That apparently. Partner. Need something. Hey, mister. What you need, friend? That's. There will be a woman looking at you, like a little girl? Maybe it's only at night? Maybe that's something I can... 
figure out at one point. Um, actually, let's look at the map here. The interactive map to see if there's something otherwise here that might be of interest. And we're with a range. We got dominoes, post office, stagecoach. Is it grave site? Ah! Here, Easter egg. Miriam Wagner. Miriam can be seen looking out of the upstairs window around midnight and noon. But who's... Who's that? Who is... Miriam Wagner? As we heard, it's, it's apparently just the girl that lives there, but what's so special about that? What's so special about that specific woman slash girl looking at the window at night? Is it supposed to be something creepy, spooky? Is it supposed to be a ghost? Who knows, maybe if it's... if we're here again when it's dark... I hope we can check on that. Um... But yeah, let's go back to John then and try to do that train thingy. And then, yeah, let's see where it heads to, because obviously, as mentioned, any any yellow quests on the map are story necessary. You need to do them. It means I will have to do that Mika thing at one point. Like always, there's no, there's no other way to it. Um, what's down here? Are that old Driscolds by any chance? It's like just a regular camp this time. I think I've even shot this camp up already at one point, but the camps respawn in some way, I think. Like that people get back there again. Yeah, I'll just leave him be, I think. Yeah, might as well. Um But yeah, like me it's just like sure, I can just keep playing now. Like this was like ultimately it was just like three or five minutes in between, right? Like that's not the end of the world. But what does that mean again? The view these are split up, which is annoying for the Twitch page. Oh, poor thing. Poor thing. oh no! Hey, need a hand with your horse? No, not again. <laughs> Shit. I knew it was gonna happen. We already had this happen before. I should have just kept moving and you would have stayed alive. Oh well. Wow, I didn't even kill him! Would have been wasted if I left that miracle tonic there. Hi there, mister. Um But yeah, not only is our WD split up now, that also means I'll have to edit them together again. Which means I'll have to render that video, which takes a couple of hours. Well, like, actually, it, it's not that long. How much did the other one take last time around when I had to edit together the beauties? Either way, it, it's just time that I basically then can't use a PC for really. I mean, I can do it when I go to work or when I'm sleeping or whatever, so it's like, you know. It's not like I lose time from it, but. Um, still, that just means, well. More, more time required to do something that wouldn't be necessary if things just work the way they were intended to. Who's there? Just it's me. me. Good. You're back in one piece. Oh, of course I am. Um, again, what's with the spice and pellet? If it's, if it's a perfect one, I would kind of want to keep it actually. Is it the perfect one? Oh, he left a reward for me now. Cool. It's a poor one, okay. The poor one, you guys can take the poor one. I don't need that. What's your problem? I already proved myself. Uh, well, all you proved is uh, how quickly you'll turn on your friends. No, no, it ain't like that. I, I, uh, I only rode with them for a while. Yeah, you might have Dutch fool. But, um... <laughs> I'm watching you. Getting good with that skinning knife, I see. Hey, Javier. Oh, that's how I pronounce it, Javier. Don't forget about all that money out there. Of course not. We're all watching you. Hmm. I saved your life, Arthur. Okay. So you had fun partying with. You got the right though. 
Um, yeah, you can get this poor bison pal, I don't need that. Mr. Pierce. Before you come any closer, the answer is no. Uh, donate. Oh wait, isn't it again that I need to have the the pelt on the on the horse or something? Actually, I'll come back to you later, okay? Wait, oh, I think yeah, that's how it works. Oh, that's so dumb. But now I need to put it back on the horse, and then I can donate it. Oh, that's so silly. That is so silly. That's a pretty horse, by the way. Wow, there's so many pretty horses in this game. There's like 50 different ones. Which is crazy if you think about it. Um, but okay, we put that back on. Now we go back in, and then I can donate it. Jesus. Which doesn't even make sense though, right? Because I have it right in my hand. How can I not donate it? Hey, Arthur. Susan! Hey. Okay, now I should be able to do that to you. Right? I haven't received anything from you in a while, Mr. What do you mean? I gave you something before I left. Actually, where is it? There. Oh, maybe I could have actually done it earlier. Here, take a bit of me too. Sure, I don't really need that. Yeah. Sure, sure. Hello, Mr. Strauss. How about it looking around Blackwater when you got strong? Oh wait, there's something else here. Home robbery with Javier. Oh. Yeah, Javier. Arthur. So we're working on a plan for that train you told me about. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what's the gift I got? Predator bait? That's what he gave to me, the predator bait? Oh well, that's kind of useless. Um. Okay, what to do first then? John is sitting there waiting to rob the train with me, I guess. But Javier also wants to do a home robbery. I just want to do the home robbery first, I guess. If I even can do it here. Huh. Both of you looking here, looking at me, both of you wanting to do some crazy shit. Let's go with you. I heard about a house. Could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... Said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Of course. Uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. <laughs> yeah. okay. Let's go take a look. Let's exactly. go, let's check. Just take a look. The question is, have I been there before? On the other side of the river from Valentine. Best way there is through Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure, more or less. That's now the question. Have I been there okay. before? Alright. Very possible that I have been. Yeah, okay, what did you say? Where is it? Son of a bitch. Hey! What the hell? He runs right into me and then insults me? Oh, at least we're quick timing that, okay. At least we're getting there fast. No time wasted. Wait, isn't this new strawberry? Where the hell am I? Okay, we're pretty close now. Okay, nice that they actually. The nice that they actually made this a bit quicker. Where am I? Oh, I've not been here before. This is new. Oh, look at that. That that's also still possible to happen. It's a really long ride, by the way. Actually, it's not that long. It's fine. But. Hmm. Yeah. Nice. The dead still can work. 
that I'm actually coming to places via a quest where I've not been to before, and it means I haven't explored everything yet. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good. I mean, obviously, I haven't explored we'll everything, but sure like you know, I mean, at least in that area. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. Hmm. Well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? I mean, does it mean we just shoot him right away, or what's the idea? Oh, up there. Oh, big place, right? You got your binoculars? Mm -hmm. I always do. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. Not a bad place to start looking. That is a pretty a place. I only it was pretty close to house. getting there already. This could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. I am. I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And... Do we? I can just I, I just shoot them. Don't worry. Me. I mean, I'm a cowboy, but at one point I was a bit of a criminal. If there's lots of money involved, then maybe I put the morals away and just uh, shoot and shit. And obviously, if there's a way to do it without casualties, then that's also okay. Hey, hey, stay with me, Arthur. I'm here. What's wrong? Okay, stick close now. Now, my problem is that it's this typical: you oh, run faster trees. while I run slower than you. I can't get a proper look at the place. But if I run well, faster than you, it'll make it harder for them to spot us too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Because again, there's the wolf nearby, the legendary wolf that I killed, so I was like pretty hey, close to just checking in too. I hear voices. Okay, sorry. I am I am armed. I don't mind if they shoot us, we we should back. Come on, let's hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Stay low, Arthur. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I's gone but ten minutes I was. You can only get all the now day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie get all the jam. You shut your gulper. Exactly. Or don't know how to your felt, get to the wall like him. You need to pull it up, boy. Up. Go guard the shed. Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What are we doing, Javier? Okay, you take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see. What are you doing? Chill, everything's fine. Jump him in what way though, by the way? Oh, I see. I think I can knock them out with my fists, actually. Oh, swanking heck! <laughs> what the hickory happened here? The hickory? Ding Lake could just throw a dynamite in there and just explode everybody, but. Okay, I mean. I didn't know you were actually about to just kill him. Why didn't you tell me we we're actually about to shoot him? I thought we were going safely. Dark though. Oh, oh my! Did you see that? Oh! Didn't he have half? It looked like he had ha half his head blown off, and was still up and shooting. Damn! All right, quick. Let's look for the stash. 
Holy! What did I hallucinate that? It looked like he had barely any... Like his face was barely, you know, still intact and he just kept attacking me. Holy moly. Talk about fighting to your last breath. Has to be under here. There's no place else that could store it. Not that chest. Hey Arthur. Give me a hand here. Give me a second, I'm on the chest, buddy. Ooh. Mmm. That's a lot of cash. Again, it's unfortunate how no matter where I look. Come on. Or no matter where I put my camera, I'm somehow in the way in something, in this case, some money. <coughs> uh -huh. oh, well. Look what we Are you already in the big stash up there? How much is going to be here? Mm. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Jesus Sounds good. Christ. What am I doing? I'm stealing money. I'm a, I'm a criminal. I made some cash. How much did we make? How much did I make? 175. Yeah, not bad, not bad. It ain't, it ain't little. Hey. Hey. I mentioned thought he distract them. And then we just steal it and we go out, but Javi is like, nah, we just shoot him up. Why not? And I don't get any minus honor for it either, so I'm like, yeah. Because if, if I don't lose any honor for it, then I just shoot him. <laughs> These people are all so honorless, I can just kill them without issues. At least morally, apparently. That's how the game looks at it, so. I'll take it. Uh, let's smoke the cigarettes so I can maybe get a card here. That's something I also need to do, actually. Mail all the, the bones to the other girl. That wants... The, 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 you know what? Because I obviously can't send the cards up until I have everything. Oh, look, here's some more money, too. Another 10. Oh, well, there's a card in here, too. The Jack Hall Gang. Huh? Famous Gunslinger's card. Uh -huh. Um, nothing else in here. There's some more corpses we can pick up here. There's definitely something in there too, right? Surely. Surely. We didn't have anything though. Yeah, hey, what's with the horses still? Oh wait, that horse is so pretty. Both of them, both of them are new. Oh look at this one, I like this one. I like that black and white. The other one's rather normal, but like also quite pretty. I think maybe. Like mentioned, I said I maybe want to try to get as many horses on for as possible. Maybe I can put Blizzard into the you know what for now. Um, and take that right one with me for now. Might as well. Um, yeah, there's a lot in here to check. Got some crackers. Again, the fact that, that I have to search everything even more. Jesus, these people had lots of cigarettes. I really fucked with my stamina, but we need more cards. Let's still try to get some stamina back though. With some canned pineapples. Mmm, pineapples after smoking, yeah. That sounds like that sounds yummy. Uh Kentucky bourbon. Maybe something in here. Maybe more money. Nothing? I don't know a lot. That's a good idea because, again, I forget that every time. Even though I haven't used it that much recently. Yeah, look, I've, I've barely used this one. I should clean this one, maybe. Ah, it's fine. 
That's okay. Why not? It is probably something here in the back too. And that's probably it with this place. Oh, that's the... That's the clock. I was like, shit, am I hearing dynamite? Is this place about to blow up? Nah. Uh, anything else here? Kinda empty. Pretty place though, I must say. You can technically make it a bit of a base too, if you think about it. Any place where there's a bed, you can like technically use to always come back to. At least when you're on your own. Air pomade, sure. There's a hat that I sadly can't pick up. And some hair tonic, but oh well. Those people definitely didn't look like they had much air though. Um, yeah, I think that's it with this place now actually. Not much else to find. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's maybe pick this horse. While we're here. What else is there even to do here now, by the way? Like I mentioned, I did the legendary horse here. And obviously I could already check out the area even more. But maybe I can do that off stream. Maybe that's nothing too crazy here. Where am I right now? Aha. Requirements chapter 2. Climb up a ladder inside the barn. Find the stash boy next to some haystacks. Yeah. Hold on. There's a pump action shotgun in here. Upstairs in the large house. What do you mean? So this one? Wait, there's actually a shotgun here? Wait, maybe in here? I haven't been in that room. But it said upstairs. But yeah, it actually did. Didn't check this one. Right? Health cure. Can I maybe use it? Sure. Hey, you didn't use it. Thank you. Is it that? No. Where's the shotgun? Apparently there's a shotgun here. But it says upstairs. Can't really go upstairs here, can I? Or is it here? Hold on. I thought it would be like another bed section. Well, would you look at that? That's why I used that map. Because otherwise I would have totally forgotten that I could go up here. Okay, gamma room. That's one thing. Yeah, that's kind of whatever, but I guess then the shotgun is on the other side. Would you look at that? Would have had to return otherwise. Aha! Uh -huh. Would you look at that? Hello there! You pretty thing. You look a bit dirty, but... I take you with me. I'm actually not Wait, didn't I even have one already though? Now that I think about it. Hmm. Not a weapon will come with me. Luckily. Um But okay, yeah, what else is around here? This is the chest porter. What else do we have? We have a rock carving nearby. We have a hat nearby. There's another point of interest, a landmark. And the shack. All down here, the window rock. I mean, if we're here now, then might as well. What else is like above me? There's a lot at the at the nearby lake. The Barrel Lagoon. That's another landmark. There's another point of interest. But there's also part of a treasure map. So I will have to return here at one point anyways. Like I might as well leave that for now. And then this upper part here of the map, where we've already been to a little bit, we will go back there at one point anyways, probably, but I'll probably do it off stream. 
Um, yeah, let's might as well check out the the rock carving up here. It's here, and then there's a head right here, and then like mentioned, there's a lot of stuff here and here. Okay. Yeah, let's pick up this horse for now. Oh, mm, it's actually brown and white. Oh, that's not as pretty. If it was black and white, I feel like it would be prettier. This like you to look at this thing. Actually, this is a unit. Holy shit, you're tall. Or, like you're huge. The other one is much smaller. Okay, we're picking one of the two. I think. I like mentioned actually like the pattern a lot. But the fact that it's more brownish than black kind of uh, I don't like the color combination as much. You like mentioned you're so tall. Oh wait, then I can search the saddlebag? I didn't wait, I didn't know I can maybe steal something from the horses. Wait, why did nobody tell me? That's a lot of items I potentially missed out on due to that. Okay, that's annoying. That's something I would have loved to remember or know. Um, yeah, my only problem now is... There's a rock carving here too, actually. Oh! Wait, I've been here before, right? Six point cabin? Wasn't that very in the beginning? No, I think I've been in there already. And cleared that. There's a double bay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a, there's a hideout from the Odriscourts. Oh yeah, wasn't that the one we did um, where we where we nearly got killed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but there's a rock carving here too now, actually. Uh, yeah, okay. Then let's do all of that for now. And I pick up you for now. Oh wait, no, that's the wrong one. You stay here. Like mentioned, I'm the biggest fan of the color, but you... Oh shit, baby, it won't like me though. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, that thing's a unit. But I don't know, it doesn't look so pretty. I'm really more about the about the face. Or like what beats a face. I'm more about the uh, how how it looks. It might be really good because like mentioned it's pretty it's pretty huge, right? But ah, I'll leave you here. I'm 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 sure that if I find it new horse to max out. I think it would be a bit prettier. I'll leave you two here, I'm sure. Some people will come back here at one point to check this place out. And they'll take care of you. Blizzard, come back to me, my baby. There you are. Good girl. Look, that's a pretty horse right there. I love the color on that horse so much. Okay. Then let's check a bit of the area first. And then we go to Strawberry, I'd say. Check what's up with Mika. And maybe rob the store. And then probably rob the train. And I think that then we might already be at like over two to three hours. Which is crazy to think about it. How much time you play this game and how little you actually make in the meantime. Kind of crazy. Oh, we can technically also maybe go and check on the ghost again, huh? Right? Oh, fuck. Ugh. Because again, there's apparently 16 encounters every couple of in-game days need to be in between the two, like in between an encounter to, to do them. So yeah, maybe we should check on that encounter spot with the ghosts every time we, we stream. Also, holy moly, can I please get up here? Oh, it's so annoying in this game to climb. Watch me not make this and I'll drop off my horse. Fucking Christ, man. Okay. This is what I mean with realism in this game. Like, why? Just let me climb up here. Aww. Man. Like, this is not what I mean. I need to be here. I guess I can go down the road then. Fucking Christ, dude. Come on. Fucking Christ. This is what I mean. Movement in this game, at least on foot. Or like if you if you want to get to a spot like a point of interest. Like if you just want to do the collectibles, like the bones and the dreamcatchers. 
it's frustrating because the movement is so clunky sometimes and it's just so difficult to actually get to where you need to be and like especially the um the bones are so high up on on, on rocks and whatnot it's a pain in the ass to get to where you need to be And offer also just stumbles after like, you know, a bit of height. Aha! Uh -huh. I need to use that more actually, by the way. Otherwise you might keep looking for it. Uh, can you make this? You should be able to, sir, right? Thank you. And inspect. Rock carving coordinations too, 4 of 10. You see what I mean? If I go from playing Red Dead Redemption 2 to playing a bit of... Um, to playing a bit of Assassin's Creed Odyssey, again I would feel like it's two different worlds. Because again, in Odyssey the movement is so great, you can do whatever the fuck you want. You can climb anywhere, no mountain is too tall, and you can jump yeah. off everywhere without dying. Oh, I missed that. Oh Christ, how am I supposed to get down you know, without issues? But he's apparently ahead somewhere. Can I climb down here somehow? I need to do it here, even though I think that goes be below. I think I need to turn around to do that. Oh, annoying. Hello. Hey there, Mister. Morning. Morning. This time of the day. Out already. Oh my God. This is. Oh wow. It's a. F it's a perfect one. But again, hunting takes too long. It just sadly takes too long. Uh, what's the best way to get onto the trail uh, of the rain? Ah, uh, the train, you know. Whoa. Maybe here. I will drop a little bit, I think. Yeah, I'll just leave my horse here for now, I guess. Ah. Uh, okay. No, I don't have my weapons with me again, though. Holy moly. Yeah, window rock is here. Ah, that definitely looks like a window. What's that? Uh-huh. New flower. Violet Snowdrop. I mean, that's pretty. That's a very pretty name. My horse is chilling up there. Can be eaten to refill your stamina. Uh -huh. Okay, and what do we have here? Wow, that's a gorgeous spot, though. Whoa! Strange statues. Again, how would you, by the way, find this without the map? Oh, show gang savings? Oh, I see. crazy would you would you just casually go ahead and find this otherwise probably not uh window rock is the landmark strange set just the point of interest the other stuff is down here how do we get there how shall we get there now I wonder how my horse will get to me now, actually. This is what I mean, though. When you're in the middle of nature like this, moving moving along, it's a pain. It's so painful. It's up there now, too. Oh. Why? 
Why? Actually, again, I need to be here too, though. He's apparently had somewhere. Somewhere there's a hat. It's unique to this place. Gorgeous, by the way, though. Holy moly, look at the visuals. Isn't this place beautiful? Isn't it absolutely gorgeous? Um, Nevada hat. There's also a note underneath the hat from... There's a note. Oh, up! Uh, oh, up on the waterfall. Also, oh, I need to get up there again. Oh. That all takes so much time, but at least my horse is with me again. Oh, but I'm not even gonna make it up here, huh? Because Arthur, this fuck ass, can climb up the simplest mountain. It's insane. Look at this bitch! God damn it, Arthur. If you had just half the skill in climbing as you had in doing any other shit. We've been saying, oh no, baby, how are we gonna make it up there now? Because look, he's not gonna make that or Oh, barely. But ain't you just gonna fall off right away? That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Jesus. But how do I make it here now? It's never gonna work, right? Nah. Holy moly, man. Yeah. Actually, I shouldn't have gone up here on stream, because as you can see, it's a pain to navigate. This is definitely something you need to do off stream, just chill it, and if it takes long, then whatever. But doing it on stream, it just takes up so much time. Okay. To the waterfall. I get some. I get some animal. Oh well, here apparently. Or maybe it's on the other side. Wait, I think it's actually there. Isn't that the hat there? The fact that I'm doing it all for a hat. It is just a hat, even. It's not even like a weapon. Somewhere here. Down there? Down there? Can't see anything with the. With the R. What the hell was that sound effect? I'm opening a video. Games Guide Channel! Games Guide's channel, I'm trusting you. One minute is the video long. Perfect. Jesus. Oh. Wait, I need to follow the railroad. I need to go deeper again. I can't believe it, man. Uh, I think it's down here. Question is, should I survive dropping down there? Wasn't I there literally before I went up again? <laughs> right, I think these are the railroads at least. Yeah, I didn't even need to go up there again. My god, it's such a time waste. Yeah, I literally need to go down again. Oh, have mercy with my poor soul. Yeah, yeah, offer. Drop down, you bitch. Yeah, I should, uh, this way here. Christ. I could have seen that, though. I'm not even gonna lie. That looks kind of suspicious. Yeah, here we go. Alright, there it is. But hey, that, that hat is pretty, though. That hat looks good, so it's actually worth it. And there's a ladder from Robert Alien Patchton. I have no idea who that's supposed to be. Oh yeah, and there's fish dropping nearby apparently. Salmons and whatever. Oh, that's nice. 
Yeah, just put the just put the, the fish in there. Hell yeah. Just put it in the jackets. You you can't have all your weapons with you at all times, but this is this works without issues. You can just put like fish in your yeah 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 yeah. Of course, game. Of course, I see you. Um. Then you can move here. And you can just stop here again. Okay. Okay, cool. It means last thing left is going down here and to the rock carving, and then we can focus on the important things again. Hallelujah. Let's eat some food. Because I'm pretty sure I'm still underweight. The thing is, though, there's like no point in eating unless you, you know. Yeah, I'm underweight. Unless you like, you know, have no have no damage. Like when you get damage or like like stamina, then eating makes sense. But like besides that, why would I ever eat? I, I need to get fatter. I need more. I need more weight. Otherwise, um, you know, less HP. But you do have a bit more stamina now, actually, I think, so... Which, again, doesn't really make sense. If we're on the way, how do you have more stamina than others? Kind of doesn't work. But again, it is a gorgeous location here, though, I must say. I'm also too, too impatient to wait for my horse right now. <laughs> um... Is it that rock? No, it's down there. There's a little shack. Little shack at the bottom of the of the waterfall. We got something in here. Are you kidding me? We had it last stream already. Where we came across this this scene of murder where apparently a daughter Yeah, Arthur, same 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 look on my face. Where we saw a daughter kill her parents and we see her having shot herself elsewhere. And now again, we just enter this random shack in the middle of nowhere and boom, it's just a it's just a vicious murder scene. That's so insane, man. Again, though, I love locations like this because they're so unsettling and just so, you know, like, what happened here? How did this happen? Holy moly. Crazy. I can't even loot them, I think. Well, I guess we can see. Um. But, like, yeah, who who did that, though? Because pre I'm pretty sure this isn't a suicide. Like, a suicide murder. This guy's definitely has a crowbar, has a hammer, has blood on both of them. Did they just kill each other? Like, <laughs> and fell down? Or. I have no idea, man. Okay, what am I supposed to find here, actually? There's a hunter hatchet, the nugget. Inside, we come across a murder scene, a crowbar, and the gold nuggets. Wait, can I pick up the crowbar? I can't. Okay. Yeah, cool. Murder scene number 15 in this game, I think. Wonderful. But where's the hunter hatchet? In there? Hunter hatchet? Actually, don't I have one already? Where's the hatchet? Wait here, girl. Wait here. What's with the window? Oh, I didn't want to climb up, but... Is it in here? I haven't searched that, actually. Where's the hatchet? Oh, nothing here. Where's the hunter hatchet? Behind the cabin, buried in a tree stump. Behind it. 
So here. But there isn't one. Oh, there. Okay. I do believe I had one already, though. At least I found a lot of hatchets. The hatchets are so weird because there's so many of them, but like I barely use it. Hunter hatchets. Here. Uh. Wait, no. I have way more than this. Like it says four or five, but hunting knife. Oh, wait. How do I check between those? Because if I press E again, I just go to the hunting knife. Because I have another knife, actually. That I've never been able to use because how do I. Aha! Yeah, here. Rusted hunter hatchet, hunter hatchet, rusted double bit hatchet, double bit hatchet, hooing hatchet. Why Why can't I find the regular one and the rusty one? What's the difference? They even have the same damage, so what's the point? They all have the same damage, it's just for visuals, I guess. Um. Oh! And this is how I change bullets and arrows, I've never done that before. These are my regular ones. High velocity, which means more range and more damage. And express, even more, less range, but way more damage. Why did I never use that before? These are just for the animals. My shotgun shells. They also have slug ones, which increases the range a bit. Actually, no, slug just has better accuracy and increases range, so of course I should use those. Semi auto shotgun, same thing here. And bow. Oh, look! These, these are the bows I should be using for, like, small animals and shit. Damn. This ammunition system feels a bit, um, very less used or, like, unexplained in some way. Because I guess you can make them and everything, but there was, like, never a big tutorial to it. Because look at how many I can make for bows alone. And this one, you can also do it, like, the fire, right? You can, like, craft them, really. Oh, and same for the, you know? Damn. <laughs> well, 40 hours into the game and I'm, yeah, figuring out new stuff. Cool. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, this is where we gotta go to next. For the rock carving and then we can actually continue yeah. with important stuff. But hey, we, we found that. Now, now it will also make sense actually to look for... Like, you know, craft new new items. Or, like, craft new ammunition. Which I otherwise hadn't done yet. But, oh my god, the water looks gorgeous. This game is just gorgeous, man. This game really makes me want to just go on a hike somewhere. And actually, where I live, there are actually some pretty locations, too. We actually have lots of forests nearby. Obviously not as pretty as insane as this. I will say America definitely has some of the, you know, most gorgeous sceneries when it comes to that. But unfortunately, there's also a lot of, you know... <laughs> like, when I think of America, I don't think of sceneries like this. I usually think of, yeah, that classic unwalkable town with 50 Walmarts. If anything, Canada is probably a country I would, ex you know... When I, when I think of Canada, I instantly think of mountains and scenes like this. America, not so much, sadly. But they kind of did that to themselves, though, didn't they? Wait, what is here, by the way? Looked like a cabin? What's that a rock? Whoa! Just a rock, okay. Whoa! whoa. Look at that train! That's something I can, by the way, do all the time, technically. Just wait for a train and I just rob it for fun. Just haven't really done it yet. Not set up the train and we rob for the story. Really? Uh, you take something and then you stay. Okay. Oh. Well, oh, that's lovely. There's a rock carving somewhere here. 
up there. Oh, I need to go back out again, of course. It's fine. It's fine. Maybe I have to drop down or something. Uh, here somewhere. And the only way you usually find out about these rock carvings is you, you ride around the map and you just see them in the distance and you can just go there to check them out. There's a camp up there? In front of me? I mean, it's a six point cabin again. Uh, yeah. Maybe I should just drop down here. And I think it's then here. Will I survive that jump? I should be able to. Oh no, no! I survived the initial jump, but then because Arthur is a slippery piece of shit, he just keeps dropping down like a fucking idiot instead of trying to hold on or whatever. But yeah, there's the rock coming. Oh, don't you dare put me far away. Wait, where even am I now? Did they put me to the six point cabin now? I mean, at least I didn't lose money. But yeah, I'm at the six point cabin, okay. What do you mean there's people now? Did people go back to the camp? Did O'Driscoll's go back to the camp or what? No way. Oh, oh god. Is that an O'Driscoll? If it is, I shoot this place up. Actually, I don't have that many weapons with me. Well, at least not the weapons I need. Hold on. Hold on! How about we shoot this place up, huh? Oh, Driscolds? That sounds like... We need to do some shooting. Is it an Eldriscoll? It's an enemy, and you know what that means. Enemies I can shoot as much as I want to. Oh well. Yeah, yeah, you fuck ass Eldriscolls. You think you can go back to your place after we robbed it? I don't think so. Ah, oh, shit. Let me take another one. The amount of times this happens is crazy. Ah! And one more. Got it, bitch boy. That does work. Okay. Well, okay, bitch. I'm coming in. Huh? 
Hell yeah. And this is why it's cool to go back to camp hideouts, because you can just shoot up more people. And this is the place to just shoot if you want to. Because again, if you just start shooting up random people in the middle of the town, your 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 honor will go down. But when you go to an enemy camp, that's that is where the fun happens. And I love these close-up finishes, by the way. First of all, very important. Um, I love these close-up finishers. If you're close enough, you literally all you need to do is you don't even need to aim. If you're close enough to someone, you just gotta press the left click, and then you will just do an instant finisher. And it's heat. Wait, that head is pretty too, though. I'm not even gonna lie. But should I be wrapping enemy, enemy, enemy clothing? I don't think I should. We go back to the Nevada head and loot the place. Ah, that's so much fun. Ah, that was so much fun. I needed that. Yeah, maybe it was. I mean, maybe I would have checked at the six-point cabin. Anyways, even if I wouldn't have died after the rock carving, but yeah, dying gave us the opportunity to shoot some people. Yeah, and not we no not people, animals. Yeah, we shot O'Driscolls. Yeah, death to all O'Driscolls. Death to all enemy gangs. Um, what is this yellow weapon I'm being showed here, though? Is this a special one? One Sheffield revolver. This one here. Oh, that's my hatchet. Never mind. The one that I completely missed on close range. That's what I mean. They, they, they are just really bad to use in combat, it feels like. Like, at what point would you rather use that than, like, your weapon? Like, what I should have used is just a knife. I just picked the knife and just kill him close combat. That's what I tried to do with the hatchet, too. But, like... And I think you should be able to, too. But I somehow always end up throwing them and then, well... That just sadly... Well... It doesn't work that well. Um... Was that it? I think we looted everything. Okay. Thanks for the thanks for the funsies. How to get back to it? Rock carving, and then we go to do quests. Yeah, the important stuff. The actually important stuff. Even though having a shootout like this once in a while is also important. But why is there another camp here already? By the way, oh, where's the smoke coming from? Looks like a side road camp again. Yeah, this time I should fall down more the middle. Like, I actually, you know, I would have survived the first initial jump, but then, like mentioned, I just kept rolling down. Like a little dumbass. Which is why we don't drop down here on the left this time. We drop down here. That looks safe. Ouch. Damn. Yeah, but how else are you so- Oh, actually, you could've just gone like that. Okay. <laughs> Whoopsie. That's fine. What even are all of these caving still? I maybe should actually pay more attention to them. It's always just, yeah. I just press E and I'm done with it. Yeah, what's up with this camp there? That's just a random stranger chilling there. I could shoot him for fun from a distance, and these people would no idea who was it, but... Ah. He ain't hurting us. I wouldn't even have needed to jump down here. Oh well. Okay, though, that means we found all the necessary things here in this area. And we can now actually move on to more important things. Um... Do we want to go to Strawberry with Mika first, or first to John? I think, like, which I will do John now. To potentially, I was about to say if I would have dropped down here, holy moly. Um, to go and potentially rob that train.
Okay, one last check about potential things here in the area. Uh, that should be it. Yep. Maybe a new bounty here? Nope, nothing either. Alright, then let's go back to camp, say hello to John. And see what's up next. And I wish I kind of had fast travel already, that would make things a lot easier, but oh well. Didn't take too long. Hey there! We basically already in Valentine. Funnily enough, I think I need to rob some people here still. Like, I need to rob some um, some townsfolk as part of a challenge. I haven't really caught up with those either, because again, that's what I mean. It's just... How are you supposed to, you know? It's just so much. Every corner, there's so many things to do. There's challenges, compendiums. It's just... Uh, how am I supposed to catch up with it all? Hello, mister. Somebody, please. Hey, brother. Nah. Nah, Mickey. <laughs> yeah. No time for you. Even though now that we're walking around here again, because there's it, there's a first clue for that murder scene, I still wonder where the third one is. I have not been nearby to it yet. Hello. Like, I don't want to just look it up and then just immediately go there, because who knows where it may be. Like, nowhere where we've been thus far, the third clue of it was nearby. We found that corpse there, we found that other corpse and strawberry on the rock. That's about it. Where's the third one? Who's that? It's me. Hope you had a good old time. I did, I did. Um, become a sheriff, Uncle Arthur? Hi, Jack. <laughs> Hi, Jack. Um, get that horse out of here. Yeah, okay, chill. Ooh, blizzard. And by the way, I think I also need to start. Um, there he is. Hello, Arthur. I think I also. Thank you. I think I need to also um it here. Should I be able to see that woman Mary Gillis about? Yes. Yes, I did. I never liked her. I know, you already told me that. Ideas above her station. Above anyone's station, that one. Mm-hmm, uh -huh, cool. Okay, I'll catch you later then. We'll see you later. Hey, Arthur. Um, because there's always this medical thing being shown to me, but I can't, like, you know, donate, donate them health, <laughs> like health products. Um, okay, John, now to you. Now to you. Oh, yeah, we did it already. John. Pouring forth oil all free. Good. You. Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. All right. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. <sighs> I mean, if he wasn't a genius, he wouldn't be the main character of Red Dead Redemption 1. Um, Abigail needs to speak to you. Oh, I read about that. A fisher of men. I've always wondered, because there were so many ponds, like, he down already, right? Where I can't find a legendary fish and whatnot. I haven't been able to fish at all. I don't have a rod or whatnot. 
and then I read that there will be a quest in chapter 2 where that will happen. This is that. I don't think I need to do that on stream. Yeah, this will just be fishing. This will be very slow and whatnot. We can do that. I can do that off stream. That's, I don't think that's something we need to do on stream now. We don't better fish. But actually though, where's the... Oh. Where's my... Where's the, the wagon now? I mean, I know where I left it. John mentioned this train job. He did. Sounds promising. Yeah. We're getting things set up now. What's that up here? Ooh. What's that? Why is there so much heat around here? Okay, no idea what's up with that. Why do I always hear people beefing with each other? Howdy. All right. Let me grab some stew while we're at it. What do I need to do it from this side? <laughs> Wait, it's actually not appearing on the map. Do I need to do the Abigail quest first? I don't want to fish on stream. That segment is just going to be very slow and... You know, I don't really think that's something I should do. Stream. Ah, oh, some stew right now would be lovely. I said it every time I do this here, but it's true. Well, whatever else is in store for us, Arthur, I'll tell you one thing. What's that? The rare old pleasure not to be freezing our balls off up in those mountains. <laughs> You're not wrong there. Be well. And you, Hosea. Hosea is a, is, a, is a cool character. He might be one of my favorites in the camp. Just, uh, just a good old guy. Um, yeah, it's not showing up. We did that here. Somewhere. So, that quest is apparently not doable right now. Weird. Especially because you literally just said it, right? Beach at the uh, beach at it whenever we're ready. Maybe it's only at night. Maybe it's only at night. That could be very possible. That this is something that only happens at night because obviously robbing a train at night might be better. Um, but okay, because we can't do that right now. Let's go. I see what's up with Mika, or Mika, or whatever. I keep forgetting how to pronounce his name. And potentially rob the stone strawberry and. I remember this more nearby that we gotta do again. Any problems you shout out, Lenny. Hey Arthur. Um There was that house with the grandma we were in where I need to return to in order to uh, you know do more stuff there. And there was another place where at random times of the day you can run into a special event. Yeah, the map tells me yeah there's a Random yep. event, but not what type of one. But we can maybe check that out again to maybe get it this time. Yeah. A lot to do in that area. Let's go there. See what may await us on the way there. The thing is, I should do the, the, the robbing part with the store last. Because remember what happened last time when we robbed the store on Valentine? We ended up with 300 bounty, so... Maybe I should do that last before I have that bounty and then I want to do other stuff. Yeah. And yeah, I actually haven't done what I said last time around, right? Where I talked about I potentially missed checking out the safe in the first story around back in Valentine. And I'm kind of afraid to try to check for it again because I don't know. Much longer. Fucking 
Christ, man. I'm saving the stranger from... From these fuckers, and the other guy sees it and thinks I'm just murdering them for fun. Christ. It's getting hard to breathe in these ropes here. It's okay, I'll have you. Uh, you're after me too! I know it! I know it! You goddamn fuckers. Man. Well, now the lawmen are gonna be here soon. The question is from where will they be coming from? I guess I can just run out of it. God damn it, man. Can I do something with you, though? Turn back to mama. Help! What the fuck, man? I saved him for nothing. I saved him and I don't get a reward or anything out of it. Hey, mister. You'd love to see it. Okay, but the crime has been reported, but I don't have a bounty yet, so whatever. It's okay. Um, even though the lawmen are checking this area. I wonder how he found him so quickly, though, huh? How did he so quickly find people? Did it just happen to be on the way? And here again, we could technically rob this train if we wanted to. I'm sure there's lots of stuff in there. There's also always people in there too, which is crazy, but... Okay. Oh wait, now it's, now it's unlocked. Yeah, there it is now. Unbelievable. Oh, we're here now. It's okay. We are here now. Oh. Oh, what's here? Oh, I've been here before. I remember this. Wait, what happened actually? Wait, there's a reason I have this camera right now. Wasn't this where I nearby killed the wolves? I've got things to attend. Don't slow me down. Hey there, partner. Yeah, there was there was the guy here. And we paid got paid to kill wolves. Where where you go? Uh, this is all destroyed now. Like there's no like no signs of like a murder spree or anything. I guess it just left the place. Weird. Right, Again, the world changes within. Also true, we need to ask that one old... We need to ask the father for our money back that we landed him. Yeah? Remember how his house kept being built as the game progressed already? This game is alive. This game, like, every in-game day is actually, like, you know, if something happens. That's what makes this game so special. That's one of the many reasons why it is. Okay, but he's chilling somewhere up here, huh? Probably will need my weapons, but you know, safety first. You never know. You never know. Who? Looked like corpse for a second. Use this horse at least. Oh, there's a scamp. Okay. Arthur, could you be any slower? Pace up, buddy. So here's where you're chilling, huh? Hey, Arthur. Good to see you. Why? You want rescuing again, do you? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. Oh, a plan like the An Black American pastoral scene. Or... Like you going off scout? Oh, look at my horse coming in the background. <laughs> Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm, I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen trying to protect his riding clothes. I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow. Lose your head. Yellow? Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me? Do a robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. Hmm. <laughs> Arthur loves himself to rob Come some on. places, huh? I know no matter with who, whatever it's Javier or Mika, he's always like, yep, I'm on it. Let's what do it. What are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? Like I told you. 
I ain't going back to Dodge without a peace offering. So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men, guns, riders? Nothing serious. It'll be fine. I mean, last time around, Mika did like all the work and just the shot 50 people. Hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. You worry too much. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful in something an old Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. Hmm? What's here? Have I been in there? At home? Uh, what just said here? Here. Uh. Wait, where am I right now exactly? Right on the E. Here. Here we are. Oh, there's a house. Taxidermist house. Oh, that's apparently something related to a quest. Okay, it's nothing important for now. Okay. Sure. Some more some more landmarks around here. Nothing too nothing too crazy. He can't be about I'm gonna be focusing on the quest anyways. It on the regular. That's a good lead in my book. Damn old Triscolls are everywhere now. Bastards got a hold of most of Big Valley. Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. Can have already made so many Lenny end up down here anyway. Oh, you know how it is. I've ended up killing so hands. many other drink gang members here, already that the old Driscolls have been like mentioned so far in my back already. Nothing that needs to concern you. And they were that big gang in the share. first part of the story. But then I ended up doing so much other stuff where I just happened to well like kind of forget about them. That's what happens when you town. don't do just the main precious story. Guns. Oh, wow. Precious they are. You need to roll a little looser. Discover so much else, and then you're like, wait a second. Oh yeah, remember. I've seen you come full undone more than once now, and you've only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing it. Then let's do it. Damn right. I do love this little raccoon who just ran with us for a couple of meters. Just being part of the gang. Also, oh, Jesus, it's so dark now. Oh, and it's now actually too late for the John quest, I guess. Or it's because we're at the quest right now, that's why it's not on the map now. Oh, I love the soundtrack so much, though. The soundtrack really comes through in the main quests. Like in side quests, and just when you casually wander around, it's like also present, but like not as good. Like in the main quest, oh, it's so good. Yeah, and now we've already passed the actual dark section. When it's like midnight, it gets right. really dark. The spot. Hold and then on once the moon stage. is out, it's actually kind of fine. They should be here. In a little bit, hold tight. Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Just don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. <sighs> they should be here any minute. <clears throat> Look, there they are. Any minute? It's morning Long now. Time. Get covered up. Come on! <laughs> right! Was the middle of the night and suddenly <laughs> it's morning again. Attack the guards and attack the stage coach. Okay. This is a robbery. Stop that coach right now. What in the Jesus, I'm sorry with my aim. You made a big mistake! Faster. This is fun for you. Yeah. What a goddamn bullet in him now! It's just the driver left. Come on! 
Let me jump on it. I don't think I've done it before. Woo! Hell yeah. Come on. Let's get this out of here. That was fun. No need to keep your face covered now. If you say so. It's just you and me, sweetheart. Well no, my horse will stay here. They put up half a fight at least. Yeah! Hey luck! Come on, boy! Does my horse follow me too? Yes! I need to do that every time going forward. Always press H before I drive away so it keeps following me. Oh, hello. Thank you very much. Hey, look at that horse following us. Hell yeah. Like licking butter off a knife. Something like that. You don't want to just break it open here and be done with it. Yeah, this is basically the robbery street, though. We robbed two wagons already. Oh yeah, we've been here. We robbed the train now, the store. Robin, Robin, Robin. We ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Listen, I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up the shit! Now we're being robbed! Oh, fuck! Whoa! Huh? Jesus! What the hell? What the fuck? And who? Come on, Arthur! Get out of there! You dumb bastards! Huh? You guys better run now, huh? Oh, I barely hit them. Fuck. You shot my head off, you bastards! See what I mean? This this is why Dead Eye never works for me though. I always feel like I use all my shots. Oh fuck, I'm sorry horses, no! No, not the horses! I'm ho I'm sorry for the horses. That'll show them. Why Price. is it? Every job I do with you ends in a pile of dead bodies. Since when did you have a problem killing O'Driscolls? Huh, huh. You've got a point. Let's strip this coach then. It clearly ain't going nowhere now. Jesus, though. Let's take what we can and get the hell out of here. That was a shootout. Look at the carnage we've left behind. That lock should shoot off easy enough. I'll give on account of well this little mess. What is it though? 
Shoot the lock? What is the you lock? You shooting it or not? That should do it. Ah. <laughs> A little delayed. Come on, let's see if all this was worth. All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls. The Mika missions have definitely been some of the most exciting ones. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at mm. that. What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its peace. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, big shadow, tiny tree. And like I said, <laughs> that still don't mean nothing. Now, get out of here. Go we'll see Dutch. Make sure you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun. It's been my pleasure. That was exciting. Whoa! How much? Did we just make over 1k with this? Okay, that was really worth it. Oh. <laughs> Headshot each of the mounted guards protecting the wagon. Get 10 kills in dead eye. Complete within 6 minutes. Complete the mission without taking any health items. We had neither. Yeah. Again, I need to practice dead eye somehow. Because again, I tried to use dead eye. But I don't... I'm not sure what the problem is. If it's me holding the left button or if, if I... <sighs> Because as you saw, I shot like all of my ammunition, like I did like three crosses on the same target. And I don't understand why. But oh my, that's big. 600 to the gang, 330 to me, 300 to Micah. Hell yeah. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. And now we can also rob all of the Driscolls. Okay, where are Driscolls actually? Because they were hooded. They really didn't look like your wristlets at first, but oh my god, look at the pile of bodies we've left behind. The amount of X's on the map. Jesus. I'd love to see it. It's a lot of looting now. It's all worth it. Is there another one I can loot? Is there three on one point? What do you mean I have it? 10 bounty, boo! The thing is, even if it's just 10, the people will come looking for me now, I think. And I actually can't waste too much time now. The only thing that's bad now is actually that I'm polluting the forest uh, and, and, the, and the river. With all the blood and dead people in here. Yeah, I don't like mention just sorry for the horses. I'm sorry y'all got caught in the crossfire, or in this case the dynamite. But man, dynamite do be just so fun though. This is really the most effective way to, to kill a large pile of people. Okay, I was about to say. They're coming towards me. And one more here. Actually, a couple more. Oh, okay, that's cool. A wild fox was going after the dead body. And you can even saw a claw mark a little bit. That's so cool. Hell yeah. Okay, any more bodies I can get? There's one. There's one. Right here in the middle. Wait, but I went for all of those. Oh, I'm feeling, I'm feeling. I'm feeling played around with. This one here. A lot of fish in you, too. Again, we can't fish at the moment. How did it even end up here? Remember, I sh shot one of them so far away. Okay! That was dope. That was really fun. Just some good old shooting. Not much else to it, but what else do you need? Um, brought us up here. Okay, this is the fishing quest. This is the main quest with John. Let's go to Strawberry. Pick up that bounty poster. And then go to the store. Wait, though. That wasn't here before. Someone just set that up.
What even is stats? No weapons with me? It wasn't here a minute ago. Ah! Uh, Chinese ringneck pheasant, cool. What's here? Oh, isn't that William's place? I mean, I don't see anybody here. Huh. Oh well. Again, there is like mentioned a potential event up here. And here is definitely where I wanted to go. So actually, let's do this first. Because I forget it otherwise, I think. The cabin. The last oh, time up. we were there, we, like, yeah. mentioned stole something from that old grandma. She talked about her sons. That they will come back soon. And then you have to go there again, and then the sons are actually there, and you can kill them for more rewards. Let's do this now. I hope they're still there, because obviously it's been a bit longer than one day now. I think we should be fine. But this is what I mean. Even when you encounter something for the first time, it might not be the last, and you have to go there again and again and again. I think there's also like a blind beggar that I've run into. And he has like dozens of encounters. There's so many voice lines to it. And technically, if you really wanted to see them. Might as well just go to YouTube, that's probably easier and quicker. And wanting to do it all in-game because like mentioned, you always need to wait in between encounters and it just takes forever. But I think that the ghost like mentioned, that apparently yeah. is 16 full encounters, that's something we can definitely do on stream every time. We should do that actually before we end this one too. Okay, let's see. And are your sons here now? I don't know who's dumber. You, Ethan, Edgar, or Ezra. Keep telling you, Ma. We'll get you a new place. Anything you want. Ain't like we're short on money. I don't want a new place. I got everything I need right here. How many times, Elijah? Shut your mouth before I shut it for you. I have an idea. But the door needs to be open for that. A little bam, 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 you know. Wait, I have two? So, gentlemen! I hope you like, I hope you like explosions. No, don't you put it away! We got a visitor! Oh. Die from that? You son of a bitch. Come on, one more. Okay, she died now. But what about him? What do you mean you're still alive? And you too. I have fire bottles. I want to come on. Yeah, this game is kind of brutal. <laughs> um, yeah, this game is... Yeah. Yeah. This game is certainly fun for the entire family. Um, hey! 
Yo, is this your first time playing? Yes, it is. This is my very, very first playthrough. I'm like 40 hours into it. I'm still in chapter 2. So I've mostly spent time exploring and checking around and just, you know, discovering things on a more slower, explorative pace. And it's been a blast. I still don't understand how the dynamite didn't kill them. How did the dynamite not explode them? I threw two dynamites into that small house and nothing happened to them. Um, but yeah, maybe I should have used the fireball because, well, this takes a while now. Do I have a water bottle, maybe? But crazy though, I actually had to use my dead eye for that. But this time it worked. I need to try the dead eye. I, I need to practice dead eye more. I think it's really strong, but I just haven't been able to use it properly. Let me start looting the corpses, actually. I can barely even tell now who's who anymore, though. Oh, I can't loot them anymore. Oh, did I burn the loot? I think I burned the loot. Jesus. Oh, she's dead. He's dead. Well, all of them are dead. Well, at least the loot box is still there. The funny thing is, we now basically left a murder bo uh, a murder scene. Like we've come, ooh, we've come across them a lot, right? So many places we go into, we open the door, and then boom, it's like 50 dead people, and you just don't understand what happened. I think if somebody comes across this, I think they'll figure out what happened. Yep. Valeria, oh, partner, things don't seem to be going so so swell. What do you mean, well? Actually, I think they are. I, I got a good amount of money here. Actually, pretty happy with that. Like mentioned, this is a place I've been to three streams ago. And then I saw apparently that you need to return to it like after in-game day. And then you meet the sons like we just did. And then you can cure them and then you actually get more money. So hell yeah. I just sadly couldn't loot them anymore. Maybe it's because I burned them and the loot just burned with them. But, well, uh, where am I? Where am I right now? Um, this is the river. Yeah, like mentioned, apparently here's a potential event. Still says there's a random encounter, but not what type of. So let's check if maybe we can get it this time. Oh, you've only ever played online? I've not touched online at all yet. Um, the thing with me in Red Dead is, I've seen... The game is like already pretty old, right? Um, I've seen... From what I've seen of the game over the years, it's portions of both the story, but very little, like only very selected things. And mostly online, actually, though. But I've never played online myself yet. Uh, okay, but there's nothing here. Okay. Um, what else here? In the area, maybe been there, we've been there. Ah, let's just go to Strawberry now. Like I said, I wanted to and rob that store. Yeah. I've, I've heard that actually too already. The thing is... Hey there. Hey there. I basically already know like the biggest spoiler possible. Um, about the death of one character, which is basically... Mm, you know, that's... <sighs> that's the fifth time in the story already that I've run into someone that gets... put like that. Oh, fucking Christ, man. That's like the third time I ran into this woman alone! How many times do we get captured on the horse? Yeah, don't worry. Jesus. Sir, please help me out of here. Don't worry. Cross my path. Best vanish quick. Chill, boy. I'm just helping someone out. Thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. I've had this exact it's same. All right, man. It's over now. Thank you. Again. Okay. Oh, goodbye. 
Um, okay then, girl. This is something I actually understand. A lot of people get so attached to, to games, especially the story of it. Um, to oh, the wow. point where... I don't like to look at you. Jail. Yeah, yeah. Um, to the point where, you know, seeing those characters that get attached to die is actually, like, very devastating. I know a lot of anime fans where it's the same thing. But, like, if their favorite character dies, it just rips them apart. Which is very understandable. Um... Weird. Um... Oh wait, I think I've been there before. I think I've done that. Um... Um, I've played many games like that similarly. I don't know if you've ever played Detroit Become Human. Or if you've ever played um, the Dark Pages Anthology games. By the way, I think you were uh, the first time in chat, right? I can't see that on my phone, sadly. Um, welcome here, by the way, if, it, if that is the case. Um, and they're the same thing, right? It's it, Both games are very choice-dependent, which makes it feel even worse. Like, if a character dies because that's just how the story's like... Whoops. That's one thing, right? But um, if a game is like choice dependent and your choices lead to a character's death, ooh, that's that's a bummer. I remember when I managed to get one of my characters get killed. I I I felt that for like two weeks, or like I kept thinking about it for two weeks, and just that type of regret because obviously I did it for YouTube as a playthrough and everything. I um, mean, I'm the type of person that, even though, like, you can go back to all the save and just do it again, right? Nah. My choice needs to matter. If someone dies because of me, then, well, my bad. Oh, shit, I have a gun in here. Um, so, you know. Then I'm unfortunately dead. Like, that character is dead. So... Oh, look, that's the stranger we just saved. Oh, now, I don't want anything Careful, to do baby. with Mac. Folk, you understand? Take that off. Chill. Oh, okay, then. Okay, much better now. Ain't that right? Sure. Okay, there. Hey, there. Um... So, yeah, it's a, it's a very understandable feeling. But, like, also the most exciting, right? Getting, getting attached to characters. Isn't that the coolest feeling about story games? At least for me, at least. Oh, you're a bean. Well, hello. You ain't a tourist, so I'm guessing you're a bouncy hunter. Posters usually go up on that wall there. You don't remember me, though? I Didn't I? <laughs> Did you already forget that I jailbreaked this place a while ago? Maybe, maybe he's, a, maybe he's a new sheriff, and that's why he doesn't know. Joshua Brown. Joshua. Only forty, though. Man, it's look at you. You barely get money for Boy, for those. A home out of an old mine up in the Big Valley Mountains, but you might want to leave that one on the wall. Josh Brown to be a hard man to kill, let alone capture. And that's Easy. what we're asking for. Got half the bounty hunters in the state out looking for him. I want your advice. I'll ask for it. Okay. Okay. Joshua Brown. <laughs> Give it to me. He's a killer. Got away with it for the most part too. Legal kills. But if you walk that line, you're going to step Wait, over it Wait, which game was point, Marcus again? This man's dangerous. Wait, Marcus was in, um... He brought us some bounties in the past, and Devil he's always been decent. If was it Mark? Bring him in breathing, Wait, who is Marcus again? I guess I know my job, Dan. Good luck with it. Ah, no worries. And where's that? Okay, up there. That's far away. Or well, like, we haven't been there yet, so... Definitely not the focus for now. What I want to do is this. Because I think... This is... Yeah, this is a robbery. Uh... Where is it? How can I check it again? Wait, in my index, I think. I need to have it on the map. I always forget the button. I always forget the button to to check everything. Missions. Marker. Oh, wait, I think it's my journal or the lock. 
bad is it? Um, tasks. Challenges, notifications, invites. Here, where is it? Uh, home robbery, the catfish Jackson. So I know where that is. Home robbery, Javier. Didn't we just finish that? Oh yeah, we did that. But yeah, that's what I wanted. Ah, oh, that's such a sensitive system. I go from 1 to 50, like, instantly. Ah! Here. Strawberry General Store. The shopkeeper in the general store over at Strawberry is rumored to be running a secret moonshine operation. Look around the shop to investigate. Well, let's do that then. Um, should I put... Should I bring more weapons with me? Maybe my shotgun. Uh, if any weapon might be helpful, it might be the shotgun. The thing is, so obviously, if I rob the store and I shoot a single person, cheat's about to go down. Can you put the weapon away, though? I don't want to have the weapon out. Oh, true, you mean Marcus from Detroit. Okay, okay, I was like, who was Marcus in the DPA games? I do not remember a Marcus. I remember Mark from the Devil in Me, but Marcus? Oh yeah, you're totally right. I did go ahead and play that game on best outcome possible, though, at a later point. Because my first playthrough ended up, like, my original Detroit Becomes Human, human playthrough? Chill. I mean, I am about to, but chill out, buddy. Um, yeah, would love to put it away. Okay. It's all out on YouTube. Hello. So, hello again. Um, and man, the percentages I had there is crazy. It's doesn't seem like I've seen you before. Welcome. You must travel a lot if you've made it all the way over here. Now grab some items for your camp. Coffee, hunting supplies, biscuits, canned items, all along the perimeter of the shop. Well, let me see then. You talk a lot. Still recovering from that day. Lost a lot of folks. At least the jail's fixed now. Hmm. You don't remember that that was me? Oh, that's a shame. Um. But apparently, what am I supposed to... He has something going on here. And I'm supposed to, to, fish with as a doctor to be looking for clues. Actually, I haven't heard from him in months, though. Uh, I can buy some canned peaches and stuff, sure. Does he have a like did the other store in, in right. Valentine had a had a back door or like a back section to the store? This one doesn't it seems. And that's what I'm wondering. Anything here? Is this the right shop? Strawberry General Store. This is a general store. Look around the shop to investigate. Is this a general store? Hotel, post office, guts, stagecoach. Yeah, this is the store. But I can't find anything in here. Funny. If it were up to me, I would have planted my shop right where the jailhouse is. Everyone sees me, and I see everyone else. Uh-huh. We have a door here, maybe, somewhere. I don't want to aim the weapon at him right away, because then everything's going to lose instantly. So I gotta be careful. But I can't question him either. Thanks. Maybe... Oh, look at this. What rope? Don't 
this lock and this door. And I feel like I'm, the thing is, if I shoot it though, it's instantly panic. I think I can't shoot it right away. Because, like, in this store, there is no space for something. A secret moonshine business is what it said. That's not like, you know. Hey, look, there must be some confusion. Great. Hey, partner. Howdy. All right, stranger. Hey, what happens when I go in here? Ah, okay. Yeah, that's what you meant with the clothing, right? Funny thing is, though, I still like my outfit the way it is. I, I liked it, the one that I had on the mountains in the snow, actually, the most, but this I can only wear it when it's cold, so, well. I think something's here. Hey, careful now. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry there. Whoopsie. For Christ's sake. <laughs> Why are you doing this? I'm only joking with you. Come on. You sure are odd. Maybe I can open this with the knife. Let me try that. How's everything going? I can't. I would need to shoot it, I think. Nah, I can't shoot here. If I shoot, it's an instant panic. <sighs> and this guy looks at me too. Howdy. Hope you won't be stirring up more trouble around here. Hey, mister. This guy's also Hi. right here. Fuck, there's so many people here. Didn't think I'd see you so soon. <sighs> you know what? Okay. Yeah. I'll ask him. I'll like I'll I'll aim at him. Maybe I should save though. Oh. Keep the door closed! <laughs> Oh, God damn it! hold on. Can I even save in here? Let's just, you know, who knows what happens. Might as well. I mean, maybe there's a secret door. Like a trap door. I don't see anything. Okay, I'm sorry, dude, but like... Oh. That was not the plan. Wait, what? The mayor will tell you no alcohol in Strawberry, but don't listen to him. Hey! What did I do? Put that down! Give me all your money. Open that thing. Oh, good thing. Yes, go, go ahead and take whatever you need. Uh... I can't believe this is happening. That's kind of not what I wanted, though. I mean, I take the money. I mean, that's barely anything shit, dude. You had nothing in your store. But that's not it yet. Tell me something about the moonshine business here. All right. You got everything you want? Leave me alone. Nothing? <sighs> All right. Fuck. Maybe it's down here? Aw, oh, shit, dude. I should have just checked here. Uh oh. Nah, or? Oh, it, it is that! Fuck. I robbed the store for nothing, I think. Uh huh. Uh oh. You can rob the shop side business. I should have first done this and then rob it, huh? <sighs> Fuck. All right, folks, move on. Let us do our work. What the hell? It's them. Uh -oh. Good. That's our man. Nothing so far. Come in. Hold it. Don't move. Nope. You move any farther, this is your last breath. Okay, you know what? We do this again. Because I'm... Okay, hold on. Uh, story... Load game... This one here, right? Yeah. Let's let's just save it again. I was like, maybe it's something down in the cellar, but where's the trapdoor? Well, I could just, could just check from outside. Whoopsie. 
Whoopsie. Mm. Yeah, now again, the crazy thing is I've played this game for like already 40 hours, but I'm still in chapter 2. And when it comes to terms of the map, I feel like I've maybe been to 30 of it, if even. Like, where have I been to? Like, look, this entire left and bottom side of the map is still all smokes. Like, I've been up here, and even here, I haven't been through everything entirely. I haven't even been to Sound of East yet. There's so much to do. But that's like, you know, as someone who mostly plays, like, story, like, multiplayer games, like League and Overwatch and DVD, or at least a good amount of it, these story games will still always be the best. And I'm glad that I've started this game and have actually been mostly playing this recently, rather than, you know... Because there was a time where I played like mostly DVD. Hey there, friend. How can I help you? Uh, not for now. Or, or or only DVD or Overwatch or Leak. And while those games obviously have to charm to you too, experiencing a story like this, it's just it's just the best. It's undefeatable. From the Assassin's Creed games to the Detroit games, or the super massive games, right? It's, it's just really it's just worth so much more. You can now rob the shop's side business. Okay, now we can rob it. And it's worth to do so. Welp. Hey, mister. Now for a second. Second, mister. second time. Howdy. Ain't that a familiar face? Welcome, friend. Oh, well, now you know me, huh? Apparently those Blackwater robbers are still on the loose. They got that whole town on lockdown. Oh, are they? Well, that's that's weird. That's pretty weird, isn't it? Oh, like, wait, they said I can now rob it. But this is like still the same store. Please, just put that gun down. Not they so fast. Basement. Basement. I want to see what you got cooking down there. <laughs> that ain't nothing. Just a little batch of white lightning to warm the old bones. Take me down there. <clears throat> he does have the trap door. I knew it. But it didn't look like it, right? It really didn't look like that. There was like no outline of it. It's uh, it's down this way. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, like I say, no, I take this in the meantime, really, right? Just a, just a little drop. On the side. I'll be the judge of that. So, uh, are you coming down? Yeah, yeah. What we got here, huh? Ten fruits. Show me where the money is. I ain't gonna ask you twice. Okay. Okay. Uh, th th there's a loose brick in the wall by the still. That's better. Okay. Uh, and now I guess I'll punch you. Whoa, please, stay back. <gasps> hey, come on. There's no... Oh, I gotta punch his glasses off. <laughs> and now he's taking a nap. He's fine. He's not dead. He's just knocked out. Okay, but that was so cool. The way his glasses basically worked as a shield... And it just... <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Mister, this is necessary. Mm. Sure. Oh, it's not too bad. 50 is... The, the thing is, once you found, like, gold bars, which are worth 500 each, all of this just seems like small money games, you know? It's kind of not worth the effort anymore. Alright. Thank you, mister. I appreciate it. And look, this time... No... Bounty or lawman after me. Mister. Howdy. Mister. I just did some business in that store. I hope you don't mind that. <laughs> that was dope. Uh, I get you a text and a message, by the way. Yeah. No, I get to your text message in a moment, by the way. Um, okay, hold on. Strawberry. What to do now? There's a stable... What? 
northwest of. Okay, there's a quest up here nearby. Apparently. That we can technically do. There's another point of interest, the rock carving and whatnot. But again, that's something I can probably do off stream. I should focus on the main quests like mentioned on stream. That's that's more exciting. Yeah. Then we just leave Strawberry this section here for now, and we just now go to the main quest with, with John. Maybe do that as the, as the final thing for the moment. Okay. I can 100% um, recommend it to you. The thing is, I've like been outside of Saint Denis already, but I haven't been inside it yet. I think the story will take me there at one point, and I've been avoiding it for now. Um, but like, all I've seen from this game thus far, and it hasn't even been everything, it's... Oh, Blizzard. Oh my god, Blizzard, why you... <laughs> <laughs> that poor, that poor bunny carcass. Jesus. Um, but even all I've seen thus far already, yeah, from Valentine to like mentioned Eastmore, you know, or Annisburg. I've been there a little bit. Van Horn is very atmospheric with the saloon there, or just you know the wilderness up here. I've been to Rhodes a short amount of time, which is pretty cool. And I think I've seen Saint Denis in in online videos though. Um, I've seen, or like, there's one YouTube channel I watch a lot that, like, played a lot of, um, Hide and Seek in there. So, I, I think I already know what Sonny's looks like, like, in the town and everything, but, like, definitely, you know. Everything on this map this far has been a highlight, and that's, I mentioned, also, again, the difference to, like, this game to now other games I've enjoyed. Like, I'm a big fan of Ubisoft games, like, what means big fan of it? I know many people are not big fans of it, but I find myself enjoying it most of the time, yeah. Says good all say one of my favorite games of all time. Like, comparing that to this is insane. Because, yes, Odyssey has a huge map, and there's also a lot to do. But, like, what is there to do? There's a camp with soldiers in there. Or there's, you know, a legendary animal. Um, or, like, at least a cave with a big animal in it. And that's basically it, yeah? There are obviously also memorable side quests and whatnot. But, like, the main portion of the side content across the map... It's basically always the same, yeah? It's also often copy-pasted, yeah? Like, there's five big beers you fight, or like, you know? It's all pretty much the same. In this game, it truly really feels like every corner, there's something new. There's something fresh. There's something you haven't seen yet. From the random encounters, not even mentioning the random encounters, right? But like, from finding new weapons, to the points of interests, to, you know, just the scenery being all so different and gorgeous and stunning. It's just, it's incredible. It might genuinely be, also in terms of NPCs and aliveness of how the, the world feels like, the most alive world I've seen in any video game I've played. Like, look at this alone, right? Hey, mister! Help me! How about we skip the small talk, eh? Huh? You motherfucker, huh? Who do you think you are? You wanted to see my horse? Oh, you better don't have any issues with what I'm doing, sir. No, no, no. Oh, um... Hey, gentlemen. You know what, that's worth it. I have enough money to pay that bounty off, I don't care. Hey there, girl. Oh, hold on. Uh you do this? Hey. Hey. Hey, mister. It's not what it looks like. Well, You're gonna keep your mouth shut. Oh, you should have shot me, buddy. Well, you see, as I'm talking about it, as I'm talking about how alive the map is and how so much shit is happening, as I'm saying it, I run into this random stranger who wants to go ahead and steal my horse. 
I grab it away from him again so he can't do it. In the meantime, two people come along, want to report me for it, and then boom. You know? Buddy. Do you ever see this in any other game? I mean, GTA 6 will probably come very close to it, but... It's incredible. Uh, what do I want to do with this guy, actually, now that I think about it? I mean... I'm pretty sure we get to it. Yeah. Look here, look. There's a good part of the train station, huh? Hey, buddy. I did so, too, now. Maybe hide my identity. Oh! You hear that? It's up here, right? Yep. You hear that? The question is, am I faster than the train? Oh, look! Isn't that perfect? Oh, it's actually a bit further away. Hold on. My whole stamina is running out, though. Wow, they gave me a 10 buck bounty. You're lucky I have issues with my stamina right now. Otherwise... Oh shit, there's more. Guys, don't mind me, please. Oh, hold on. I actually can use horse items still to raise the stamina. Yeah. <laughs> Are we faster than the train? Surely. Come on, Blizzard. Come on. Speed up. I think I need to get away from this. Let's get the max speed. Yeah, you see what, what you did? Gotta be really fast. Where am I even now? Whoa. Oh shit, we're here! Oh fuck, we're at Valentine. I don't think I can make this actually. Okay, now. Get him! No! Why are you so slow, Offer? Oh fucking Christ. Oh wait, they're stopping here. Oh wait, they're okay, never mind. They're stopping. Come it's on, fine. Man. Wait, this game isn't getting updated anymore. I thought Red Dead Online is actually still getting updated from what I've heard. Jesus, don't we really chase that train? Actually, I hadn't looted you yet. Let me go this minute! Nah. Hey, you santo! Here we go. What do you mean I lose honor for robbing him? This bitch was about to steal my horse. That's the second time I, I find an NPC that rubbed me so the wrong way I want to, him to get run over by a train. Uh, boop. Well, and now we wait to the train. Nope. Not that. Um... Oh, you mean for online? Well, yeah, that's understandable. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Well... I think he's getting dragged along, by the way. Oh, well. Don't try to steal my horse next time! Um... The thing is... the. I was about to say about the bombing each other. Um, the online map I use, or like the map I use, also has stuff in it that's only for online. Oh, Jesus. 
Oh, his body may have gotten dragged. Oh my god, it actually leaves a bit of a blood trail behind. That's insane. Holy moly. Um, No blizzard for him. No blizzard yeah. for him. Um, oh, Let's pay the bounty then. While we're at it. Um, but only for a moment. Like, it's only 10 bucks, you know, like, here, whatever. Again, you missed when I first started playing the game. I ended up with a, <laughs> with a 300 bounty, good, like, within bro. the first hour. Like, I robbed the shop here, and then ended up shooting, like, 50 lawmen, and then, well, whoopsie. Yeah. And it took me a while to actually pay it off, but... And like mentioned, once you find some gold bars, it's like, it's pocket money. Um, but yeah, that online map actually, or like that map actually has a lot of I. Ooh. Has a lot of items from online as well. I'm like, I, I went there and I'm like, wait, what am I supposed to do? How do I find this item? I can't see it. And then I figure out, oh, well, it's actually... What is that? It's actually, um... It's actually only a thing online, which is kind of weird and annoying. Oh? Why are there so many lights? Oh... Well, so much for... Getting to that place for now, huh? I think I have some other business to attend to for now. And I know how to do it. that I bought that scope. Good plan. Good plan. In the middle of wanting to be cocky, he just... Look. Thanks, guys. But are those Driscolds? No, it's just strangers. I'm not even losing honor for killing them, though. Didn't lose honor for killing them, nor for looting them. But they're not gang members. Interesting. But yeah, that makes killing those places on range definitely much easier. You see, the thing is... I feel like now the game, like, you know... I actually don't even understand. Really? Wow, that's like really not worth it, huh? Like, there's a bit of horse stuff in here, but besides that... This is kinda... This is kinda not worth it, huh? Oh, no, that was not the idea. Oh, I can sell it, though? Oh, I didn't know. Wait, I actually wanna see how much that it... You're supposed to loot the guy! Um, I wanna see how much that it's worth it. That's a good way to make money. Um... I actually don't understand, looking back at it, why I didn't play this game when it first came out. You see, the thing is... God, it's so far away. Um, there was a point... Here. Need to go there anyways, in that direction. There was a point where... But there's fire up there too. Oh man. So much to check. It's not gonna be worth it, I think. Yep. Um Whoops. Or Oh Okay, my horse needs to follow me. Um It took, like, I wasn't allowed to play games like this, right? 
once I turned 18, I was allowed to play all the games I wanted to. But before that, yeah, games like this or other 18 plus games, nah. Yeah, not allowed to. Which is actually not a bad thing, think about it, right? Because I'm pretty sure 9 year old kids playing Call of Duty is definitely, yeah. We've see, we see the long term effect of that. Um, and this came out in October 2018. And I turned 18 like a month ago, or like a month before that, so... How did I never pick this game up that, at that time? Like, again, I knew that it existed. I actually, I don't remember when was the first time I watched videos... ...of it, but... I always knew it existed, and I just don't understand why it took me... ...nearly over, over five years, or like over five years... ...to actually go ahead and buy it, and play it. I just generally don't know. Maybe because I was overwhelmed just by looking at it or like, you know. Because again, you definitely need to take your time and, you know, you need to find a right moment to start a game like this. Because I've had it before where I start a big game, but then I don't find time to play it again in a while. And then you kind of lose out on, you know, you forget about the story a bit and you lose out on the mechanics and you're just not in the flow anymore. And I mean, I've already had a couple of days break playing this game. Like, it's not been that much to, to the point where I'm like, ah, I kind of don't feel like getting back into it again. So maybe it was just that, but like, huh. Being better now than never, right? Holy, holy. Yeah, basically too. Like, I remember, or like, I know it's one of the most, it was one of the most anticipated games ever. Yeah, I heard so many good things about the first one. And it went like seven years to this one. It's like, you know. I knew that there was hype for this game. Has someone ever picked it up? Even though what I saw was always cool. Maybe I'm just dumb. Yeah, maybe I'm just I'm just stupid. Even though I believe Assassin's Creed Odyssey oh, came around at the same time. Either. Maybe even shortly before it. Which is crazy if you think about it also. What? Apparently there's this Isaac with the little girl on this window. But I don't see anything. I don't see anyone on that window. Yes, and that's also the thing. These games take so long. And I'm the type of person you need to know. That wants to finish a game like this with the story. That means every other collectible, you know, everything's finished to 99.9% and then I wrap this game up with the story. Yeah, with the final quest, with the final moment. That's how I want usually to end games like this. But obviously, that will take a while. Getting everything, like in this game alone, all those dinosaur bones and whatnot, it's, it's a lot. Hold on, I need to... Uh, mm, no license! Okay, how much I'm getting for this? Here for you. How much are you giving me? Is it worth this? Well, ain't this a lovely little thing? Deal. Spend it wisely. What are you giving me? Is it worth to see those cage, uh, cages? Cages? Coaches? That's as much money as I get from getting that bounty from that one, you know, so... Yeah. That is certainly worth it. Wait, is that your list of games you still need to play? Not sure what Firewatch is, but same for the Life is Strange games. Oh, the things I've heard about those games. Ay, ay, ay. That's now the crazy thing. This already basically now takes up all of my time that is not spent with, like, DVD or League of Legends or, like, other multiplayer games. And I haven't even been playing those a lot at the moment. So, basically, my main focus at the moment in terms of playing video games is this, actually. And then there's all of those games. I haven't played all the Assassin's Creed games yet. Uh, imagine I would want to be playing other stuff like Counter-Strike or Valorant or any other shooter or whatever, you know? It's just too, it's, it's the same for music. There's just too much great music, too, too many great video games out there to actually be able to catch up with everything. It's just impossible. And here's the problem. Here's why I probably didn't pick up this game. Yeah, I see it here. Sanskrit Odyssey was released on October 2nd, 2018. This game was released three weeks later. That's the problem. 
I was so deep into Sanskrit Odyssey and so in love with Cassandra on the Greek world, I just didn't have time for the Wild West. That's literally the main slash only reason, probably. I was had so much to do with that game, I just never got to, to this in the meantime. Um, <laughs> if I count the AC games, yep, absolutely. What, which, which AC games have I played? Odyssey, Origins, started but never finished Valhalla, mostly because of in, well, like mostly because of performance issues of the game itself, but also because the game is huge as hell. Yeah. Um, and I finished the original, and the reason why me rush. So everything in between, two, three, Brotherhood, Revelations, Black Flag especially, Syndicate, Unity. That's minimum 500 to 1000 hours right there, huh? Oh, and is that Odrisco camp back again? There's an Odrisco camp in front of me. Uh, but I think I just want to do the main story, you know? We'll let those boys there for now. Yeah. I couldn't greet him. Okay. I say I tell it like this the game is really not that big Ooh. What are you doing here? Why are you making so much noise? Shit. <clears throat> Wait, what why are you even here? Uh, well at least it ain't your job. Ah uh, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. I can scrap Arthur. I'm just not good at homework. I can see. Besides, not a fun story I can tell you in a moment. Care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. English Calm accents down. are so You better funny. sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you mm. ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please. Yeah? Grow up. <laughs> and let me come on the radio. You little just... kid in him. Great. Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. Did that you just call me son? Him has set kid? Up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. Take you Again, when I put that oil thingy oh, down the last time, it was again. dripping, so I have no idea how it is, even still something there. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? Mm. And my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. <laughs> Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guard, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. Okay. <laughs> And where are you? Find the future. In all its glory. Oh, yeah, well, good luck. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. Wasn't it literally just night? Um, I actually finished Assassin's Creed Mirage Wake up, you in like around 30 hours to 100% with everything done. What are you doing here, kid? I'm so it's really job. not that job. big. I said and like in comparison coming. to, you know, yeah, well, I guess the reason why it was only 50 boy, so on, on release too, because it's just not as big as the yeah, other the games. Jesus. So that's something you can Can't definitely easily do in like a week. Stroke. You know, like you five sure hours every day. No. <laughs> definitely Are we ready? Yeah. more of a quicker one. That's no Odyssey or Origins or Valhalla. I'm ready. But still pretty good. But now the funny thing is, as you're talking about sales. Let's go earn some money. I actually had bought Red Dead Redemption 2 at one point already. Hey, all the horses untethered? Think so. Um, this is too slow. On a website where you good. can usually get it for you a bit, you know, us. less money, you where you can buy the code for it. Wolfman. And I did that. Yeah. And then I realized afterwards, oh, it's for spot. Rockstar Games Launcher Remote and not Steam. Still give them enough time and that was like a few wagon. months ago. And then this Christmas sale, I bought Red Dead Redemption 2 again for like 20 both times, but for Steam. So I basically wasted 20, 20 bucks because I bought this game on accident before Rockstar launch and not the Steam launcher. Shouldn't be too much the way it 
Just the action that requires a brain. Yeah, that looks a bit weird. <laughs> oh, you're a funny fella, John Marston. And my folks, eh? You had your feet up the whole time. Do I like this game so far? It's already one of my favorite games of all time. Easily. And we're still in chapter about. two. I don't even know how many chapters there are. I have discovered like half the map, if even. Probably not even half. Have you heard? Still so much ahead of me to do. Um, and to wrap up me rush. Uh, you can find all of my VUDs to that either on my Twitch or what I prefer, you can check out um, the VUDs on YouTube too. I definitely prefer it when people watch it there again. Twitch. I want to stand by the way. I've been there. Who? Oh, our horses are following us. That looks so silly. That looks so silly. Look at the look at the gang. Look at the gang just you know riding here and then in the background you have all the horses. That's so funny. Ah, uh, go up. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, like this. <laughs> oh, that's the plan. Pretty much. Charles, you deal with the engineer. John. Secure the passenger car fast. Okay, we got John and Sean and Charles. Sure we have chosen any names that don't sound that much like. Focus on the baggage car. Grab any variables you can find. Maybe we should listen actually to the plan meeting. Get a bullet back. So what are you doing? I'll run one. Keep an eye out for outriders and the law. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Okay. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to die here. Okay, so no unnecessary shooting. Yeah, we have Mr. some Smith. honor. Mr. Smith, Mr. McGuire, yeah. get over there. When she slows, yeah, we might be criminals, but criminals with slows. class. I'll do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. Oh, and I'm now just like. Here she comes. Okay. Nobody needs to die. That's the. That's important. Soundtrack. The fact that that works! Doesn't a train should have like like a couple mile long What's going on here? What's going on? Isn't it like a truck that really needs quite a you know a couple fifty meters to actually make track? I need to get up there. Finish up here, join us on hey. board. Alright, get on that train! Faster. Hey. No need to insult him. Okay, nobody again. Nobody is supposed to die. Everybody, stay calm. Sure. Sure. You get shot. Go. Everything you got. Money, valuable. And again, I could do this all the time. And these guys are definitely heading towards Saint Denis. They definitely look the part. Anytime I see a train, I could get on it and rob these people. I don't know if you see a lot of bounty. What's the problem here? This is unnecessary. Money, Don't do this. Just give it to him, Thomas, please. Thomas! Thank you. Oh, look at the total rock. Nice. People like you make me sick. These two seem to think we're playing games. Amy, what you got, mister? You won't get hurt. Please don't hurt. Look, out to three. How's he not knocked out instantly? Let's just do what he says, so this can be. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. You make this quick. 
No, you go ahead and look for the baggage car. Tough guy, huh? You sure about Why that? Why are you wasting our time? You huh? show this son of a bitch we ain't playing around Quick, here. Come on! Damn. This is like kind of awesome, but like also kind of cruel, you know? I mean, I say it like this. These are definitely rich. Huh? What you saying, sir? Sir? What you saying? You see what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm fully into the role. Like, we know they're rich people, at least. Yeah, they can afford this. Yeah, it's not like we're like robbing homeless people of their last cents. I can handle this from here. Yeah, we're just taking from the rich. Yeah, we're Robin Hood. Okay. Our, we're the Robin Hood gang. None of you folks move a muscle. Empty your pockets, mister, and you can be on your Thank way. Thank you. Only 137, though? That's nothing, buddy. What is it? You alright? Fill the baggage car. For Christ's sake, you ain't even taking a look yet? I can't rub it anymore, okay. Okay. What's up here, huh? Then I will be unlocked. Oh, now I can't wait. Ooh. Ooh. So up until this point, I could. It was always automatically. Probably that's why the dead I felt so terrible to use because it was all done automatically. Oh, this could make sense. We're seeing double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. That's why it. <laughs> that's why I always ended up with like three crosses on one person, here. and then that I already is out. Oh, I needed that on maximum, and now I can actually probably use it. All right. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? <laughs> Harsh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. When doing me best, all right. I know, that's what's worrying me. These folks are rich, all right. I already have a gold pocket watch. Shit, I can't pick it up. I'm sorry, buddy. I can't rob these people. We'll take that. Okay, something, there's gotta be something big in here. Chill. Just a small jewelry bag. Oh, jewelry, platinum pocket watch. Nice. But shouldn't there be more money clips around here? It's kind of disappointing, isn't it? I mean, three to five, sure. But again, one gold bar I found in the... I had found in... That one... Arthur! One quest. Two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Right, you know, one gold bar is worth more than what we just Arsh looted here. Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now. Do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way, neither of you get killed. Goddamn liberties. <laughs> There's a few more than torn enough. Uh oh. Big mouth. I was about to say. Okay, let's deal with them. Okay, let's try out the improved Last dead eye. Oh. We got more on dead eye. But it didn't really work. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Maybe I should have done that. Coming from the trees there. Can it you? Ah! Uh. Huh? Sean, you goddamn dumbass! <laughs> Sean. Sean! Damn it, Sean! God damn it, Sean! Okay, but now let's try Deadeye again. Because I instantly shot him. I, I didn't tag him. Oh, 
You see? I shot him right away. And it's still pretty good though, right? Like, it's still a very easy way to get a headshot on someone, but like... I'm supposed to tank them, I'm supposed to do more than that. I have no dynamite! Oh, I hit this. Did I? Oh, fuck, my horse is in the way. What the hell? He has a bullet in his stomach. Look at my horse just chilling in the middle of all of it. I think my horse can't be killed in the division. Maybe that's why. What the hell? Oh, but there's so much to loot. I don't want to go away yet. Look at all the corpses here. Wait, where? You're supposed to follow me? Okay. Let's go, boys. Do I have my bandana on? I do. Uh... Oh, fuck. There's a lot of them. I'm dead. I want to dead or alive. Jesus. With me, boys. You are. Good job, crew. Let's get a dope shot of that crew here. Bam. And we out of here. Ah, oh, but there were so many corpses to loot. No. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was fun, boys. Real fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just got killed, buddy. Uh, there wasn't another universe. Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Yeah, that was still just up. law turned hmm. up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Again, Maybe. it was like four hundred bucks. One gold bar is worth more than that. I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine. See if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way. We should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah. Oh, wow. I think I once again mess up everything here. Flying the tracks, blah, blah, blah. Escape the law with one with 30 seconds with the dead. Kill all the train guards before Sean fires a shot. Oh, this one didn't... I couldn't clear everything because I was already full with stuff. Get 10 kills and dead eye, complete a mission without taking any half items. Oh well. That's also a thing. Imagine you want to get a gold for every mission. How often you will have to replay those. That's something I will do at one point, like for myself, but like, you know. Jesus. But yeah, again, you know what I you know what I mean? How am I able to tag them with dead eye? I use dead eye, I put a cross on someone's head, they're instantly sh dead, but then dead eye is over. And I supposed to cross, 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 and then boom. All at once. I don't get it. Um, but well. The boys are heading off. Uh, I'm pretty sure that... The corpses will no longer be there. Which is unfortunate. I would have like mentioned really love to... Well. Get all of that. Um, the other remaining main quest now is the one with Abigail. What I want to do... To wrap us up. Oh shit, I'm one of the dead or alive in here though, huh? Because again, I think I've been online now for around over three hours already. Don't forget, our stream broke at one point. Um, let's get here again. To have our second encounter um, with the ghost. I'm not sure if you, I'm not sure if you know about it. I'm not sure if it's something that isn't online. Yeah. And I, I'm really not sure about it that much either. But my friend told me, hey, look at that area. Always around night. Especially when it's foggy. You can meet a ghost there. And there's 16 encounters to it. And I was like... 16? Like, actually, first of all, a ghost? And then 16 times? 
Yeah, you should definitely check that. Hey, move it. Because definitely, otherwise, I would have either yep. never found that at all, or by pure accident, which would have been dope. Yeah. Imagine I'm just casually there in the middle of the night for fun, or like just strolling by by accident at that time, and then suddenly I hear voices, or like a voice. That's at least what happened in the first encounter. We didn't see anything. I only heard a voice. Good morning. Hey, partner. Morning. Oh shit, that means it's morning though. Fuck. Like I literally yeah. didn't see something, but I did hear a female voice talk in the middle of the swamp. And even then, though, right? Ha, ah, fifty. Even then, though, even if I would have run into that by accident. Would I have checked there again? Maybe. I probably would have looked it up at that point and then I would have known about it already, so... Well... Hey there. Um... Yeah, the thing is, now it's morning. So now that probably won't work anymore. Yeah. I mean, I could obviously just... Well... Use... The camp and just... Whoops. Please help me. That the snake bite fairy? Again? <laughs> Wait, that's the same one? You won't believe it. I got bitten again. I was like deep. Suck it out of me. I was like this happened twice before already. I believe I'm doing this. And now I've run into some <sighs> one of the two again and he's got bitten again. Buddy, what are you doing? Oh man. Never again. If I have run into that guy one more time. Oh man. I can't believe it either. I best we get back town. The funny thing is, I remember watching one of my favorite YouTubers play a bit of this game, like just the beginning portion of it. He met someone like that too, that got bitten in the leg. He sucks it out, and then as the guy's fanging him, he throws dynamite on him, and he's literally saying, Why you help me then? Oh god, and then he explodes. It was hilarious. Yeah, he should stop just roaming around the, the, the bushes. Oh, and this is one of my favorite locations in the game. I actually um, found this place off stream. Oh, that was so spooky. It was in the middle of the night. Little ghost town here. Such a cool location. So many creepy little locations in this game, it's so cool. Um, yeah, like mentioned, I think I'll have to, unfortunately... To do this here, I'll have to set up camp. I think it's too late now. There, hey, mister. Around here. Yeah, I mean, I don't really have an issue with... The thing is, in-game time does matter in some way, but not all the time, so like, it's fine. It's fine. Let's set up camp and maybe, yeah, see what's up this time with the encounter. Let's do our casual 17 hour nap. Yeah, the classic. Yeah, who doesn't do that? Just just sleep for 17 hours straight. <laughs> God, I wish there was me same. Oh. oh, it's just a tree stump. I was already like shit. I'm already seeing something there. Um, okay. Finale of today's stream. Will we? Or what, what's up this time with the ghost? Somewhere here. Where the fuck am I? I set up camp here and now I'm here. <laughs> Excuse me. How did how did my how did my camp get set up completely elsewhere? Also, why am I seeing red on the? In front of me. Eh? 
better don't be the bounty hunters. It might be the brutes. I know those are around here too. Oh, but oh well. Let's go to foot and check. It's foggy too. It also said that, that the foggier it is, the better. The higher the chance. Have I been in that hut before? Oh yeah, I've been in there. I think that's called Trapper's Shack or something. Okay. Get back at it. Oh wait, maybe someone's in there this time. When I was in the last summer row, nobody was in there, but... That's not what I'm here for. Let's eat some... A few good beans, or salmon in this case. What the hell? <laughs> Fucking muskrat! I thought it was a snake, that would have been bad. Okay. Hey there, buddy. Don't mind me, just passing by. Leave me alone. Jesus, close your eyes. Yeah, I noticed this tree already. In this spot. But... Oh my fucking Christ. Damn. The fact that Odyssey and this game were really so close to another and both of them have such annoying bores in it. Very telling. Last time around there weren't so many alligators here. But also this time I'm not seeing anything. Or hearing anything. Didn't see anything last time either. God, there's so many. Oh. Has it been enough time in game? Between encounters? You saw that on a the map, there was a white point for a second. Oh wait, that's something entirely else. Hold up. Is that her? Is that a ghost? Hello? The voice last time also said stranger. I do have a bad feeling about this though. He is a bit suspicious. Man, you all right? Ma'am? I've already run into crazy shit in this area, so... Fucking knew it. I was I I was just about to get close enough and then I look on the map and I see red okay. dots appear. Ah. Yeah, you bitch. Oh fuck. Creepy bastard. It's a fucking Murphy brute. I think that's what they're called. Ah I was just about to, like, because I remember, I think I even took a photo of it. Oh, that piece of gore was hanging in the air. How there was a... He just has casually bad carcass with him. 
Um, oh wait, actually no, this might be different though. Because the Murphy brute is actually like talking. Like actual people. But they were like actually just making gibberish noises. There might be even something else. Um, but yeah, I did encounter the brute already. Well, oh, fucking Christ. Um, <laughs> there was a dead corpse hanging from the tree and I wanted to investigate it and suddenly four people attacked me. So anything around the swamp area... Suspicious. Suspicious. Uh, but yeah, again. I didn't encounter something here. It's definitely the right time. Oh, fuck off. Fucking Christ, it's like a minefield. There we go. Music now, though. Nothing? Really? Again, apparently foggy is the best weather for it, but... See anyone? Ah, oh, that's just a ball. Fuck off. Oh, that's why so many of you are here. Hope you guys don't mind. I stole your babies! What time is it? Wait, where can I see the time? I thought I can do that with 9. Ah. 5 a.m. Well, shit, it might already be too late now. But I mean, we were there as it, as it literally turned night. I think it was like till 9 a.m. or something? Oh. But, yeah. I couldn't see or hear anything this time. Again, I don't think it's guaranteed. Wait, sh shouldn't it say it on the on the on the interactive map actually? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where's the spot here? Oh, between 9 p.m. and 3 a.m. only when it's foggy. So the time is actually already over. Okay, I'll try it again. 9 p.m. and 3 a.m. I'll, I'll try it again. I'll try it again. <laughs> She's on bath salts. Now even 19 hours of sleep, that's two in-game days now, Jesus. You can encounter this event 16 times with two days between each encounter, is what it says here. It's right now... Which time of the day? Now it's night. But there's fucking bounty hunters on the way. Shit. Please leave me alone, people. Okay. It's definitely been now two in-game days. But it did also read I can only see here with my binoculars? Like, like night vision? Uh, 
I do not hear anyone. Again, it said when it's foggy though. Only when it's foggy, so it's literally just not the right weather. That's so unfortunate. I would have loved to have that on stream. I mean, yeah, I don't gotta look around here actually. No point in, in doing so. If it says it's only when it's foggy. Between 9 p.m. and 3 a.m. only when it's foggy. Yeah, well, that's unfortunate. But isn't it getting foggy now? Or is it just because it's getting darker? I think it's only because it's getting darker. Or? 137. Seems a bit foggy now, huh? That's maybe actually just the night now. That's very disappointing. And again, that's what I mean. Even if I maybe would have made it around here at the right night time, which is already a very small window. Shit. Maybe we wouldn't have even made it. But it is foggy now. And I think the time has now run out already. Nearly. Couple more seconds left. Am I hallucinating? It definitely sounded like I heard a mumbling, like a mm-hmm. And now the bounty hunters are here. God dang it! They're even on my camp now, these bitches. I mean, yeah, now it's definitely past 3 a.m. Oh, man. Imagine that now counted as the second encounter, by the way. Oh, it's not. Technically, there is still time. But I don't see them anymore. Or I don't hear anything. You better stay right there. God fucking damn it. Oh my god, I hit the tree. God damn it. That's really disappointing. That's the exact expression I have. Oh. Jesus. I really think I heard it for a second. And I maybe actually did, but then the time ran out or something. Or maybe it was not the right spot? Who? Okay, there's a stranger there, apparently. It's apparently around the L here, so yeah, it would have been. Oh, oh man. Imagine how the dust count has encountered, though. That would be sad. You just hear mumbling for a second. Or maybe that was supposed to be the encounter. That's possible. The dead bit I just heard. It's very few noises. Um, are actually supposed to be what's the second encounter. Yeah, the flower. Yeah, it's... Oh, wait. It is there. Oh, shit. I'm about to get attacked, aren't I? Jesus. Hey, let me examine it. Hello? I didn't pick it up.
Wow. Okay, that's a bit buggy. Hey, Benny? Oh, Barry. I was like, who's Benny? Who the hell is Benny? Fuck. I can't loot it, though. Um, okay, there was this Stranger thing still here? Okay, it is. Cool. Yeah, but maybe, like you said, maybe the, maybe there's another type of clan that lives here called Swamp People. I'd really not be surprised. Okay, it's sadly past 9 a.m. now, like past 3 a.m. now. What a short time frame that is as well, right? Because again, I'm not sure how fast in-game time is, but as we can see, it's really not a lot. This couple hours really, really went away fast. Okay, but what's up here now? Oh. What are you doing here? Around this time of the day. And I can't interact with you. You're chilling here while there's fucking lunatics running around? What is happening? And you're not saying a word either. Huh? Why was this why was this shown on the map? For what reason? Like it's not a side quest or anything, it's just He's just sitting there admiring me. Having a little crush on me. Again, I'm so underweight I can just throw in more fish if necessary. I'm okay, sir. Well, it was nice meeting you. I can't even interact with him. Okay. <laughs> sure. Uh. Yeah, as I said, I think I want to give it one more attempt. If it then doesn't work again, then oh well. Maybe I should actually pay off my bounty though, so that I won't run into bounty hunters again. Imagine I actually do encounter something cool and then I get shot and it gets cancelled. That'd be, that'd be tough. But yeah, our camp is still set up. <laughs> Imagine you just sleep 17 hours, you're active for an hour, then sleep 19 hours and then you're active for like 2 hours and now you just go sleep again. Again, I hope in-game time wasting it isn't too much of a problem. I think it shouldn't be. I mean, obviously, stuff in the game still happens in the meantime, but... I think it's fine. 17 hours, 18 hours, and 19 hours. That's fine. Is it bad to waste in-game time? Red Dead Redemption 2. Apparently, not really, don't see anything. Yeah, but bounty owners are definitely nearby. Fucking Christ, man, that's so annoying. Okay, right now it's... 12. And it's not even foggy once again. Look, they're still here though, that's crazy. Oh wait, that's a bounty on the music. Yeah, might as well run towards them, shoot them, and then come back and hope it's foggy at around 3 a.m. Yeah, it sounds like a plan actually.
I will also say... I've definitely gotten more or less intimidated by the bounty owners in the beginning when I had my bounty for so long. With like six people chasing after me, it was always like... Shit, I should run away, I should run away. But nowadays, I just shoot those bitches. But the stranger is now again here? Okay, I guess I tried to interact with him this time. Again, it's not foggy anyway, so you know. The hell is up here? You're once again just chilling? No, I can talk to you. You a loon or something? This night folk country. Night folk. I can look after myself. <laughs> okay. Oh, Maybe it's the trapper. So troubled. That's his shack down there. It's night folk. And I would. It's just. Okay, that's company. what they are. They're not swamp hey, people. They're night folk. Would you help me? Oh. Uh, get them off. Well, I, I pay you for your troubles. You pay me, huh? Maybe. Well, show me where this place is. We'll see. All right. Let's go. Hey, it's just over there. Okay. You good man, partner. So I guess it was too early then again already. Like the time ran out, but he was still there. But okay. The night folk would put me on the this is what it's called. The night folk. Hang me up on a hardwood hammock. Boy, I'm lucky I ain't dead as it is. And then like mentioned it, the shack that's down there at the at the shore, oh, that's bad his. Bad folk. Animals, a lot of them. You know, I ain't never heard no night folk speak. There's not been one peep out of no night folk. Not that I ain't heard it at least. Imagine not uttering a sound. Can you fathom that? Mm -mm. What kind of evil don't make no sound? It's bad, all right. Bad. I mean, I don't meet many folk out here on my own, for the most part. But I still speak, you know. Well, I talk to myself, ain't no one else around. Chew my own goddamn ear off. I can imagine. Now, used to be the game. I love how Arthur is just actually also just like entranced by him. I've been snake bit more times I like to remember. Ain't been gator bit though. Got that to be thankful for at least. Gator bites is nasty. Kind of badass though, I don't know, it's such a cool duo. Just a cowboy and a trapper. Mm -hmm. Then turtle bites is bad too. They call them snapping for a reason. Yeah, well, I've been known to snap too. So, <laughs> how about we keep it done? Wait, so the night folk have like... Y yes, partner. Yep. They have uh -huh. like their own hideouts? Follow the old Kajun? But I want to see how late it is. I mean, it's probably already over, huh? Don't you worry about no bats. I'll tell you when you got to worry, But yeah, now that right. no, all these, the blood on the tree makes a bit more sense, too. But it's crazy because there's like a regular town up there. And that were like normal people, so... Where even are they hanging out? Why are we so slow? Can't go much faster, though. Jesus, I probably waste another in-game day. Oh, I see something. Yeah, we've been there. Went those on the on the tree a while ago. Oh hell! Look at that. He fresh. Oh yeah, that guy. Yeah, yeah. See what I mean? This night folk work. Oh. We now just follow the I traces. Fella. Good fella. Didn't deserve this. Now come on. All these bats. More damn bats. Well, what now? What's the plan? Where are we moving? Slow down. Hey, hey. Poor fella on a tree been here for years. You think it's bad being a dead fella on a tree? 
It's worse when you're a live one with a stick through you. I can't imagine. Lamps out. They might not speak, but they sure can see. I don't even have a lamp. Now look out here, there's gators. Yeah, I've what seen that too. A place to make your home. It's nice, ain't it? I heard you have a ghost roaming around nearby. Ever heard something about that? This is technically where I could be meeting it, but well. Ah. I haven't been attacked by one though yet. They're always running away. They're imposed by my insane physique. But yeah, again, I literally just walked it slowly. There we go. Up there. Oh. Night folk up to all sorts. You go deal with them. I'll be here with my rat gun. But I've, sh okay. I've been there before, though. Can. I guess they oh, just now they appear once when it's Poor fella. Oh. Oh well. This is your hat. I know uh, your hat. I know that. So. Action. Oh fuck, this time they got both. Clear off of there. Jesus, dude. Jesus. The only other time I was ever one shot in this game was by the hermit. Up there. Night folk up to all sorts. You go deal with them. I'll be here with them. Christ. Okay. You know what that means, huh? A rat gun. Okay. Do what you can. Oh, I think I'm actually burning down your 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 hut now, but I hope that's okay. Hey. Okay, just some more questions. Hey. Okay, just Clear stay on distance. Shit, they're coming. Shit. Yeah, not this somebody. Yo, you, you just brushed it off. Damn it. Oh my god, he has a machete? Oh, and I can pick it up too? Hell yeah. I will say to the things I've seen involving machetes in my life. Ooh. XXX. Some arrows. Damn, no, that does make the night folk terrifying here that they can actually one shot you. Oh, I actually believe if you burn someone, they will lose their loot. I'm pretty sure this is what this is actually is. Yeah, yeah. Burning someone means you lose loot, or like they loot burns. Boy, oh boy, that's gotta be more of them. Oh, fuck. Uh. I'll see. I don't like this. Not at all. Ah! Jesus. He's right here. Ah! <sighs> oh no! No! I missed the shot! Fucking hell! Oh no! And yeah, the hermit was the, like, you know, the, the character we killed earlier with the train. The, the first person I killed with a train was the hermit. Because he actually killed me the first time around. I wanted to um, get him with a rope. And then he opened the door and just instantly blasted my fucking face. Oh boy, that's gotta be more of them. Boy here. Okay, I gotta go outside. I need more place. I need more space. I don't like this. Not at all. Oh no. More. Go! Oh. Okay, it did say I should, I should, uh, I should protect him. And the first thing I do is run away. Boy, oh boy, that's gotta be more of them. Boy here, I'll see. I 
don't like this. Not at all. Oh no, more. I just shouldn't be losing shots this time. That guy doesn't look like Nightfall, though. That guy looks more regular. Come on in, boys. Yeah, yeah, get your ass off my lawn. Oh my, what the fuck? Okay, I mean, come on, though. Oh, that was close, buddy. <laughs> okay. Nice. Well, well. Okay. I got something for you now. What you got, buddy? I think I've looted How this place doing? before, actually. Yeah, so. Oh my God! Look at all those arrows. Want it? What is that? Yeah, sure. Here you go, partner. What's that? What is this? Swamp trash? No, that's some of the good stuff right there. You good man, mister. Damn decent. You might want to bury them bodies. It's a couple off the line, huh? about them. Food for the gators. True. Gold tooth. Oh, a perfect muskrat pelt. Oh, that's actually kind of nice. That's definitely something I can put to... And bring to the trapper. Wait, isn't he the trapper? Isn't he actually a trapper himself? Wait, no, it said on the map that this is the trapper hut. But he's actually called Old Kajun, so he's probably something else. Uh. Wait, how did you die, though? I can't remember killing you up here. But yeah, what a lovely place to have a have a hut, huh? But surely this isn't it though. This wasn't like their 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 main stay. This was just a it was just an ambush we had to survive. Oh. Yeah, but this guy somehow looks more normal than the others. Like, some of them actually look a bit deformed. And some others actually look like... A, like this guy, right? Oh, wait, he's... No, he's just a random stranger. Oh, well. Okay. So much for that little side quest. Is it even... Wait, is that on the map? Aha! Uh -huh. Actually! Oh, look at that! A fine night for it! Quest giver old cards in chapter 2. I need to have had at least one night for encounter. So, the, the, the girl we met there, right? With the, crying, with the crying woman, that was one of those, and then boom. Okay. Cool! Cool, cool, cool. That, that's taken care of. Oh yeah, it's it's called Trapper's Cabin on this map here, but that's about it. Um, is my camp still here? Because yeah, I would like mention. Love to do this if possible. Oh, it's four a.m. What a shame. Okay, one last attempt. Yeah. I set up camp once more, I sleep another 15, 16 hours or whatever. And we see if we can maybe run into something spooky. 20 hours this time! Yeah! Jesus. I mean, my stuff in the camp keeps going here, huh? like all the, you know. Been out for like five days now, they must be wondering where the fuck is Arthur? Okay. Here we are once more. 
Bounty hunters are nearby, obviously. Fortunately. It's a bit foggy, I think. But the first one towards them, kill them, and then we're back, and then it's, you know... It'd definitely be the proper time. Just a different button. Okay, using that I like that definitely also works. I don't need to take all of them instantly. I tag someone, shoot, instantly go back into that I and yeah. Yeah? That definitely makes things a whole lot easier. And if anything, it might even be smart now to keep the to keep the bounty because it just means you get bounty on yourself to you and it's just free loot. Like that's that's certainly worth like you know a couple dozen bucks. But okay. Here. This is our area of desire. It's foggy definitely. Let's look out. Quick, the time goes away though, Christ. Actually, though, it's not really foggy, is it? Oh man. Is there a way to make it foggy? Can you make it foggy in Red Dead Redemption 2? <laughs> what I find is people asking how to have less fog. Cool. Lovely. Again, this already looks quite suspicious here. I feel like this location maybe will have something to do with the girls, but... I don't know, I barely heard anything from it. I think it, it said one line. The first time, in the first encounter. But I can't remember what it was. But we didn't see anything, we only heard it. Heard a female voice. Oh. What the hell? Oh yeah, that's one of those regular camps, right? Oh no, it's like just a cabin. It's our cabin. What's up there? It's again, we have no fog anyway, so there's like no point in well saying here, I guess. That's so sad! What is this then? Hey, I remember you! Come on! I remember you too! Oh, this is what I mean. This is what I mean about this game. I met you too. Got a whole new recipe gonna be so much better than the last one let me tell you i met these two guys in like the first or second stream in the first we 10 hours we really use some of the plant life growing nearby i think you'd be able to help forage for it why not world could always use more moonshine right i saw I met some these... milkweed nearby i met oh, yeah. these guys near I the fort wallace oh, oh, that's so long ago bones. Toss the plants into the batch so we can test it out. You know what I mean? Same with William and Albert. You meet one of these... You need... You, you, uh, you know? Meet one of these strangers. And then like a couple hours later you're wandering around the map and you're like, Hey, look, I remember you. That's so cool. Good to see you again. So cool. One of the best parts of this game. These reoccurring people. Well, all right. Here goes nothing.
That's insane, man. That's just so little time. Actually, don't. Maybe I should make it evening. Because it's 9 p.m. to 3 a.m. The moment I go for night, it's already 12. So maybe I should just go for the night and then I have more time to wait. Oh, well. Can't win them all. We'll try again later. Well. Damn. Well, I ain't miserly. You got us something at least. True. Grab some shine in that chest. Very generous, thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. The moonshine is sadly full, but That's... that then. I hope you guys don't mind if I take this too. Bye bye. Next time. <laughs> okay, I think my camp actually displaced it's on its own, right? No, it's still there. Okay. Real final attempt. Okay, this time I pick evening, so it's nine. Then we'll have more time to check for it, and yeah. I know, it just feels so dissatisfying to look out for this for so long, and then nothing. Again, maybe it was the mumbling already. And there was the second encounter. Hey! Little shitheads. I definitely need to make it to my camp then afterwards, so otherwise the people will think I'm fucking dead. Okay, sleep till the evening. Mm, and then we see. Is this evening? Is this evening? 6 p.m. Okay. Yeah, we can kill the bounty hunters again and then we will have a, the, the same time we need. That's okay to me. Okay, but now let's try it with targeting with Q. They are test subjects. We're so in it now. I did, I sadly ran out here so I couldn't use it again, but. Jesus. Okay. Now I know how dead I works, and now things are going to be so much better. I think this is how it, used, how it worked before in 2 though, maybe, huh? And I just didn't have the controls again? I don't know. But now we know how things work and everything's gonna be great. Lovely. And see what I mean? Platinum Pocket Watch. That shit is worth a lot. That is good money. That is genuinely good money. Damn them. My food is really not that good, huh? Some of the food is that really not that good? Um. Okay, what did check? Is he now in here so, by the way? I feel like it would be interesting to see. The bodies definitely disappeared. The gators were hungry. Why was I running so silly? Yeah, well, it looks like he's actually not here anymore. Because again, I've been here in this place long before. And nobody was there. Wait, there was not salted meat. Good. 
Again, I'm still steadily underweight, so... I can gladly throw in 50 things at once. Have I ever checked into the wardrobe, actually? Oh, I don't think I did. That's a lot of bait. But I can't really use that. Awful. Wait, now I can take it. I did eat it. No, never mind. Where's salted meat? Canned peaches, baked beans, cheese wedge. Oh. Here it says salted beef. And here it's salted meat. That's... Game. Game, what are we doing? Oh, it's foggy as hell, though. It's really foggy. And it is. Now oh, we need to wait a bit more. A bit more waiting. Yeah, we maybe want to... Uh, I mean, I could try to hunt a crocodile in the meantime, or like an alligator. Wait here, girl. Now it's now we are in the right hours. I mean, no bounty hunters. It's extremely foggy. I think if not now, then never. If not now, then never. Um, by the way, how's it about my weight now? I'm still underweight. I just threw so much shit into me. And I'm still underweight. That's crazy. Like, I'm literally just stuffing it inside of me without even, without any usage to it. Not even hungry. Isn't there, isn't there a disorder for that, actually? Where you can eat and eat and eat, but you, you don't take any weight at all? That's offer. Or maybe it's because these things just barely actually have anything to it. Okay, how late is it now? Okay, still half an hour to go. Might as well leave the area a bit, and then go back into it. Maybe that might help too. Maybe sleeping right in it is also not the best idea. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill. Jesus. I'll call the new herb. Wait, but isn't it now no longer foggy? You gotta be kidding me, man. It's been foggy the entire time, and now the moment we have the right time, it's no longer foggy? Remember when I said I would only be doing main story things going forward on stream? Yeah, so much for that. I feel like I've spent another... Haven't I spent, like, the past... 30 minutes trying to look for a ghost. <sighs> oh man. It's fine. I can I can put it cool in the title and thumbnail on YouTube. Robbing stores, robbing no like Robbing Robbing trains and hunting ghosts. Exclamation point. Huh? That's that's money. Yeah, but now it's no longer foggy. That's unbelievable. Um, I do see... That's the wrong weapon though, actually. I can't even hunt now in the meantime or something because I don't have the right weapons with me. Unbelievable. It sounded like someone screamed for help again, but... Huh. Oh, and look, the bounty hunters are already on their way again. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay, we go to them, shoot them. Maybe the fuck returns in the meantime. And that's all we can do. 
Oh, they're not even coming from you directly this time. Was dropping down. Oh, bitch. Who? Huh? What do you mean I lost honor for that? Why can't I lose honor killing bounty hunters? That's the first. Don't even have time to lead others though because I think it's now foggy. Oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, now or never. Now or never. Now or never. Now or never. Still have a good amount of time left. Like four hours. It's foggy. Or is it once again just the moon? Or the night that makes it look foggy. I think it's that. Unbelievable. Well then that's just so dumb though. Like you actually just gotta get lucky with the weather. And we had it foggy earlier but now not anymore. <laughs> I feel so taunted. What are you guys doing around here at this time, actually? Hey there, mister. Hey, partner. There's a brown rat, there's an American bullfrog. Unbelievable. I'm so focused looking for any, any trace, anything, but I just don't see anything. So sad. So much time invested for nothing. I'm dead on stream. Wait, what? Did I just? Am I currently cooking a meal out of my out of bad meat? And horse, why did you come? I told you to stay. Oh. I mean, good girl, but. That's my girl. <laughs> uh, and stay. Okay, now I can make it stay? Oh, no. uh, but yeah, I guess. Hmm. I can't remember it looking any crazy different though, by the way. When we first encountered it. Just an animal. Jesus fucking Christ, why are there so many coyotes here? Whatever you call it. God, I think it's anyways over already, huh? So, the right time. And all I can do is just look around and wait and hope. But there's nothing! Absolutely nothing. Imagine like Arthur returns to camp and everybody's like, where have you been? It's been over five days and you're like, well, I was hunting a ghost for five days straight and slept like 20 hours each day. It just really put you to therapy.
Oh. What even is that, by the way? I guess that's where I'll go to in a moment when this doesn't work out here, but... This does look suspicious a bit. The bounty hunters are already coming back, actually. Holy moly. I mean... It's... no oh, fucking Christ, dude. It's definitely no secret anymore that I've been roaming around this area, to say the least. Oh, I'm not even going towards me though, actually. Yeah, 20 more minutes. I might as well tear this down already. The look on his face, though, that was a look of disappointment. That was a look of sheer disappointment, thinking, holy shit, I wasted so much time here. Oh my fucking god, and now I got bitten too. As if it couldn't get any worse. I don't find the ghost, and then I get bitten. Honestly... I mean, it didn't say anything, but imagine it's because I have a bounty. Now it's foggy though, by the way. Literally, mere minutes? <gasps> Jesus Christ, dude. What the hell? Mere seconds after it's past 3 a.m., it gets foggy. I'm feeling, I'm feeling taunted, I'm feeling trolled. Yeah, it's past three already now already. Holy shit, dudes. What's up, girl? Probably some shit snake. Come on, girl. Unbelievable. Okay. We were not successful with our ghost sound. If I am doing I think the next time I'll do this, I'll do it off stream and I just let the camera roll in case. So that if it does happen, I can record it and I can then use it for a YouTube video down the road. Maybe make a compilation out of every time we count it. That sounds fun, right? I'd, I'd say so. Um, yeah, but well, that's unfortunate that I spent so much time for this and couldn't find anything. Okay, though. I guess I call it quits then for today. How long have you been streaming for now? Over four hours. Way over four hours. Way over four hours. Um, don't forget the first part that went like 40 minutes. Sadly, my PC froze. So, okay. Um, that was still a pretty great stream. I think we did a lot of stuff. We robbed a lot of places. It was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun with it, and I hope you guys did too. Um, I'll send you guys over to. My favorite league streamer, the wonderful Poe Belter, um, and I'll probably meet you here again tomorrow. Of course it happens off stream. Of course it happens off stream. I spend like 30 minutes on stream. Or more. And then I end up finding her off stream. Of oh, fucking course. That really is extremely similar to... She never loved you. She never did. The one in GTA 5. God dang it! I waste 30 minutes on stream finding, looking for her, and the moment I do it off stream, she appears. Oh, fucking course. 